Oh, this is exciting. The feels are so real. And we're gonna get, this is, I think, the beginning when you get the little pop-up, if I'm not mistaken. We still have our, um, oh, here it is, okay. We still have our mallow command active as well, and the banjo. Certain parts of Echoes of the Eye can be intense for some players. If they become an obstacle to you and uh, your enjoyment of Outer Wilds, a Reduce Frights option is available in the gameplay menu. Perfect. We're going to try without, and I'm guessing I'm going to have to turn it on. There's no harmoni harmonica or oboe emoji. Thank you for supporting Outer Wilds Ventures. A new museum exhibit is now available in the Village Observatory. Okay. Oh, I haven't played in so long. It feels like years. I saw Andrew uh, tweeted he never changed the strings on the banjo from years ago when he recorded the original game songs. What? How's the volume? Are we good? Yes. Are we set up pretty well? Yes. 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 We apparently suffocated our last death that I played this. <laughs> Uh, thank you for the follow. Thanks for supporting a fellow human. Welcome in. Oh, and I have a notebook ready. I'm ready to take notes if I need it. Mallow. I have to remember all the controls. Hey, Slate. Oh, this is so weird. Like... Can we just do a cycle here? I guess I should go get my, my suit. We stick around for the start. Didn't want to miss the beginning. Poor Solana, I'm all alone in the eye. Chai, welcome in. How's it going? I don't even know what I want to do first. We gotta test out my jetpack memory. You didn't miss anything, Chai. I just woke up. First loop. Oh, do we want a loop counter for echoes? I didn't even think of that. I feel like first loop is just gonna be me doing the, uh... <laughs> remembering how to jetpack again. There we go. You missed a horrible gasping sound. Yep. Isn't this where the, um, the Easter egg is? Yeah. <sighs> We're just gonna be here for a little bit. Doing the bonk thing, exactly. I forget how to use the the walking controls. And per the channel, <laughs> um, what, playthrough, how my first one went, we spent a lot of time here before we took off, so. You know, we're in no rush. We're savoring it. The sunrise being back in Timberheart is so good, I know. It's my favorite. Embellis, hi, welcome. It's good to see you. I haven't had a chance to, like, the Interloper started right after I finished my playthrough pretty much, so Interloper crew hasn't really been here for, for streams and stuff. It's gonna be good to hang out. Alright, should we go right in? Should we check it out? What's gonna be new? I don't want to miss anything. There's some papers here. Oh no, what happened to Ta? Your son looks so pretty for now. <laughs> this is the same. Outer Wilds Adventures founding members clockwise from top left, Hornfels, Gossen, Slate, and Feldspar. 
Oh, thank you. Hey, Tasty, welcome. One of my community members made it. Interrupt just thought of Interloper while we were in your spoiler chat. That's so rad. Adding fun tune commands? Okay, cool. Big thanks to these additional founding members of Outer Wilds Ventures, without whom we would never have gotten off the ground. Matthew Steinhauer, Ben Etherington, Cordy the Pie, Jordan Frith, Tom Cummings, Sean Spark Shark Templar Farrell, Stephen Ursel, Ryan Omrecker. Cool. Cordy's in there. Mods can now use a uh, loop command. Sweet! Outer Wilds Ventures, Timber Hearth's first and only space program, was founded to explore the farthest reaches of our solar system. Feldspar was the first Hearthian to be intentionally launched into space. It completed the for first orbit around Timber Hearth and later made the first of what would be many landings on our moon, the Adel Rock. So for anybody that, um, I think I saw Pratt asking earlier, anybody that didn't see the Outer Wilds playthrough, I'll do a little bit of reading and exploring, um, and, and recapping as much as I can. Uh, but I think as we go, you'll, you'll, you'll see more of what's going on. Oh, what? Okay, I want to talk to you. Hey, I was just about to come find you. Look, look, look. You've got to see this. The Nomai statue's eyes are open. They, uh... Used to be closed. Probably should have started with that. And now they've opened. We're not sure why they opened, since no one actually saw it happen, but this is huge news. Should someone tell Gabbro, or maybe Ryback? Oh stars, this is so exciting. It's making my stomach hurt. We knew they were open. I'm. It's gonna be like a bit of me remembering what we already know and what we don't yet. Hey Hornfells. Look at this, the statue opened its eyes. Bet you wish you'd seen that happen, huh? Ah, <sighs> me too. I'm not even a little closer to understanding what's going on with the statue. Um, I'm good for now. Thanks. Skulls, welcome. I'm not 100% on the base game, no. Well, yeah, I don't have, what is it, archaeologist. I never got that. I'm assuming that's what you mean. Bonin, hi, it's so good to see you. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna get emotional with like the first loop. Okay, this is, we know, this we know, this we know, this we know. I can read these again if I want. I'm, I'm it's skipping the thing that we, <laughs> that's uh, <laughs> okay. All right, what are you? New exhibit. Ooh. The radio tower here on Timber Hearth was built to receive transmissions from our deep space satellite, and to this day still houses the first ever photos taken of the entire solar system. These photos were made possible by the deep space satellite's unusual vertical orbit that carries it high above and below the plane of the solar system. Thanks to a recent upgrade, the deep space satellite is now responsible for generating the real-time solar system map used by our newest astronauts. Okay. Interesting. I've seen a lot of the DLC but haven't finished it yet. Nice. Echo, welcome! Thank you so much for the raid. How was your stream? What were you doing? Web, Porcus, Anna, Rascal. How's it going? What were you doing today? Nay, hi. We just got started with the, with the DLC. It's good to see you. How's Genshin today? Nice. Hi friends, I'm Jen. Uh, we just started the Outer Wilds DLC today. I'm I'm jittery. I'm nervous because I've been looking forward to this game for so long. Thank you for bringing your people over. I appreciate you, Echo. It's very good to see you. I am not here. I've had I have not played this. Fair enough. Already following, but if I could, I'd follow you again. Oh my gosh! Thanks everybody. Everyone, go follow Echo as well. Always glad to have you in the chat. 
<laughs> Full time friend Jen, I'm Web Tomato. Uh, we are exploring, refreshing my knowledge of the controls, and then we've got a brand new exhibit to go explore. So we've got our first, I guess, goal. Um. Does this look different because of? This vertical orbit? <laughs> Weird. Uh, things look the same for now, except for you. Beep beep. Look at this little red dot. Oh, well. Kind of hard to track. Anything new over here? I don't think so. <laughs> Did I hear beep beep? And now you get whoops. Beep beep. Alright. I know, I know. Get to the launching part. Get to the launching and the crashing and the exploring and the new stuff. I guess I guess that's all we have to go on so far. Well, we want to go look at the ship's log, too. Did I hear dire, dire docks? You did. Yeah, that sound alert we took, uh, you know, from the Mario 64 bad camera angle noises. Man, it's just nice to hang out here again. Are you glad I can only push that button once? <laughs> I like that alert. I think there's a reason it has the cooldown that it has. I've been watching so much Super Mario 64 on Twitch lately. For a second I was like, wait, what? <laughs> Wrong game. This is a job for a human. One who's tough. Also and has a, has a big, big heart. heart. Chai, thank you for the hundred bits. Thank you for cheering for humanity. Take your time. I also took time to look around when I first kicked up the DLC, admiring Timber Hearth and being in awe of everything. The emotions were had. Yeah. There's no rush, but I, I don't even know what to do with myself as far as exploring. Where do I go first? What do I do? Say hi to everybody. <laughs> Thank you for the follow. Thanks for supporting a fellow human. I was going to write a cover of DDD for my mother's Irish band to play. Good place references. Yeah, I love the good place. Same for me, uh, but it's Metal Gear Solid alert noise, which is my ringtone. <sighs> Alright, let's go. If we don't immediately go to this new... Uh, observation satellite. We can at least practice flying around. I have a feeling I'm gonna need some flying practice. Um, and we and we need to look at the ship's log. Is there anything new inside of our ship? This is the same. We can refuel. The scout stuff is the same. We have scout back! Yes! <laughs> Oxygen. Our controls look pretty much the same. I think so. Alright, let's do a little bit of light reading. Let's use the Zelda item jingle. Nice. Shout out to Ryback for being able to play banjo with spacesuit gloves on. Seriously. 
Um, I guess if you want to see where I ended my progress for my playthrough, we did not 100% it. I don't have all the achievements for the base game. Um, we, we did go back and get a couple alternate endings after finishing, and um, I have some of the achievements. <laughs> But not Hotshot. I never got Hotshot. I never got um, Deep Impact. And... I don't know. I don't even remember, to be honest. Hotshot was hard, yeah. I tried it. I messed around with it for a bit. Deep Impact made me mad of how long it takes to, um... To set up. Like... That's a time commitment. <laughs> Are there any, um... Any flags for us right off the bat? It doesn't look like we've got any question marks. Ooh. And it's not on here. And we don't know that we can get to it right away. Whatever it is. Let's go fly around. Our first blast off. We've got our suit on, right? Uh, lift off cam. Three, two, one. Blast off. That noise again. What do we want to go do? The solar system is our oyster. We survived the first launch. Play out a wild. Thank you for the host. I appreciate it. Welcome in. Geeky, hi. Welcome in. It's good to see you. Good to see everybody. We have not done much yet. Just remembering how to fly. How to match velocity and such, and how to not get pulled in by the sun. TT, thank you for the host. I appreciate it. Who do we want to go see? Do we want to go check in on our buddies? We're not going to see anybody if I just drift and drift and drift. We want to go check in on our an anglerfish buddies? Wanna go see Gabbro? <sighs> Good to see you too. A uh, third of the way, I don't have glasses on. <laughs> Maybe we'll even get a hug from an anglerfish if we were so lucky. Uh, fun fact, if you've never watched me play this game before, and we'll see if this changes for our playthrough this time around, I almost never used autopilot. We manually flew everywhere, not because I didn't know how, but because I just liked flying. And and because autopilot uh, kills you into the sun all the time, so um, that's a thing. I also never used the like ship nav GPS because I was like, well, I know how to get there. I don't need the extra ping, but it would have helped. <laughs> All right, let's try to go in here. Thank you for the host, I appreciate it. Kofsky, hi, Apamese, hi, welcome. Never forgotten autopilot's many betrayals, exactly. Like, I don't know, maybe I'll just... I'll see how I fare on my own. We can plummet to the sea, it's fine. I know, we're not we're uh we're going to see Gavro. That's our that's our thing here, and remembering how to fly. At a at a place where it's like relatively safe for us to just fall into the sea. <laughs> 
Does Gavro's Island not have a, like, landing spot, though? I can't remember. I mean, I don't see one, so that's fine. Ooh. Oh, that's ghost matter. Right, right, right. Okay. Like the tornadoes? Isn't this a cool looking planet? Scary though. Thanks for all those hosts everyone, I appreciate it. We've got our suit on. Let's go get used to the heavy gravity again. And uh, try not to die. Relationship with autopilot is one filled with love and hate. Pretty much. Hi friend, it's been a while! Hey time pal, nice weather we're having. Wait, have I used that one before? I, you know, let's ask, how do you say so calm in impending, the face of impending death? Deep breaths, no, seriously. I meditate. Want me to teach you? It'll be the next loop before you know it. Do we want to go explore some more? Yeah, uh, we will keep that in mind. We know how. Yeah, we know how. We didn't used to, but now we do. Meehan, welcome. Gosh. Uh, let me remember signal scope. And listen to your flute noises, okay. Let me remember flashlight, okay. <laughs> uh... Let me remember scout and photo mode. We totally know how that works. Okay. And I guess let's launch again. Three, two, one, blast off. Alright, alright, Jen. What do we want to do? I'm in awe. I can't- I can't focus. <laughs> it's like that, you know, little kid grin. We going fishing? Do we want to hang out on Bramble? No. Did you know that in real life it's harder to fly into the sun than it is to fly out of the solar system entirely? I feel like it came up in our playthrough of how odd it is that you get sucked into the sun so easily in this game, as far as real life physics go. But I can't remember for sure. You know what I want to know is if this DLC has something to do with the gutter. Like, I don't remember if I can get there on my own. Because it was really hard for me to get to. I did it off stream in one of our uh, Discord streams. But I want to go look. Indy, hi, welcome. Alright, we're just checking it out. I don't want to go hang out with the anglerfish, but here we are. Oh, do we want to remember how to do, uh, how to do this? No, wait. How to do this? I don't know if we're gonna be able to pull it off. We're gonna run out of time though. First loop is like, let's have a nice observation point of the end of the solar system because we are out of time. This is so weird. Listen to that music. If you want to leave the solar system, you instead already have the velocity and simply need to add enough to leave. Hello, end times, my old friend.
Supernova survival predictions were where I got most of my channel points. That's right, Magus. I had forgotten. You made out with so many channel points after all of the uh, predictions that we did from this game. Picking a spot to watch the inevitable heat death of the universe. Indeed. Seems like as good a spot as any. Loop number one. Oops. There, I wanted to unlock on. Dang. Never gets old. Never gets less weird and scary. Bye! See you next loop! Oh, Here's our mask. Okay. I feel pretty good. Flying feels okay. Jetpack feels okay. Um... Space feels okay. Let's go eat another mallow. Probe coming to Timber Hearth this loop? Hello? <laughs> um, he's late. Oop. We'll have a burnt one. <laughs> hey, Exomorph. Welcome in. How's it going? You know about photo mode, so I think you're more prepared than 90% of streamers. Oh, I didn't on my first playthrough, so... <laughs> we have an advantage now. Alright, let's go get the suit. How are we gonna do this? Can we go visit this thing? What's gonna happen when we go there? If we go there? Do we just head straight there? It's a practice loop? Three, two, one, blast off! hang out on the interloper. Let's not go into the sun. Let's pay attention to where we are. Can't just hang out and look around. Doesn't work like that. I don't know. What are we doing? What are we doing, Jen? We're cruising. They said it's a deep space... It's gonna be way out there. Like... How? Mm -hmm. Oh, can we? Hmm. My space knowledge is gonna be tested. This is DLC. Yeah, exactly. Um, yeah, returning to the solar system. Nope, buckle up again. I forget how to, uh... There we go. Abort autopilot. It's like, how do we do that again? Is this gonna tell me... How far up and up and up I can go? Are we gonna get a cursor? The other thing we did do... We went on an Easter egg hunt off stream and got some cool stuff uh, that I think... I don't, I don't know if it'll be helpful or not.
There's like this tiniest little satellite thingy you can get to, and then there's the uh, the probe that you can chase down. Do I want to be just out here floating around? Do we want to go look for other people to talk to? Uh, that looks weird. Carol, hi, welcome in. Community are sweethearts who love this game and rage at spoilers, yes. <laughs> I had no idea about Otter Wilds community during my base game playthrough, but now when I started playing Echoes, I felt excited to hear Jen and Chad's perspective on it. Aww. Now you're part of the community. And feel free, mods or anybody, anytime you feel like it's appropriate to do the interloper uh, command, have at it. We love to get people in there. I don't think many people know about it. This, this feels like the achievement where you try to escape with the warp core. I'm just out here in space floating around and doing the most. We went too far. It's such a great group of folks, exactly. It links you to uh, Skulls, it links you to the Discord called the Interloper, and it's a whole group of people that love Outer Wilds, and we go to people's streams who are playing it for the first time and watch respectfully without giving any spoilers. A lot of people, I'll just go in and watch and maybe say hi and then lurk, and you get to experience someone else playing it again for the first time. And like, we're, if somebody's finishing, if they're getting to the end of the base game and seeing the grove or the glade for the first time, they'll send out a message and be like, hey, hey, we're coming up on the end if you want to catch it, if you want to see it. Or they'll write messages like, it's their first time doing X, first time at Quantum Moon, that type of stuff. literally how I found you playing the witness from a uh, witness discord <laughs> Zara welcome in how's it going if you're interested you um, just click the link it'll take you to the discord then there's a, a rules page you have to read the rules and react kind of like a lot of community discords in order to uh, to participate People often get to see spoiler chat when they're done with the game. Yeah, that too. The witness topic on Twitch? Nice! Doing your workout even though you should be sleeping? Oh no! I mean, working out is good for you most of the time. Sleep is also very good for you. Watching people play it for the first time. Cool, Pratt. That's awesome. Yeah, we're just, uh, we're doing, like, a very <laughs> nondescript, <laughs> far-out spiral thing here. Um, I'm gonna try to... What is this that I'm doing? Match velocity so that we're not just at a weird angle, and then we can come in closer. When I work out, I sleep better. Well, yeah, true. Mm-hmm. Me too. Being 100 kilometers away from solar system reminds me of deep impact in attempts. Oh, wooden. Yeah. <laughs> it's so rough. We're so far out. We should do it. <laughs> we should do an attempt. We might as well try to sneak one in. Maybe we should go to Whitehole Station. I don't know why. Should we just revisit everything and see what we find? See if we have any epiphanies? The sun doesn't disappear nearly as early as it used to. I know. 
Excuse me. I was like, well, I can still see it. But, um... <laughs> you can see it from further out now. I'm coming in pretty fast now. That's our only sense of where that thing is, is map view so far. And we're we're gonna get we're just gonna get, end up getting another supernova. What am I not thinking of? I don't even know what I'm not thinking of. You don't know what you don't know. Maybe we'll go- maybe we should hang out more on Timber Hearth. Gather more evidence. We have so little to go off of. I don't think I can match velocity while spinning around and looking around like that. I also... <laughs> have a feeling it's gonna start really slow and then pick up as we learn things. I'm gonna deck out for spoileroos. Have a good stream. Thanks, Indy, for hanging out. And yeah, don't get spoiled. I hope you have a blast with your playthrough when you get to do it. Timberhearth is a great planet to hang. It happens to be my favorite planet to hang. Speaking of the interloper, Again, Twitch removes sort by viewers low to high, and now they only have high to low. Twitch is doing some interesting choices lately. Um, like, pay to boost your stream. What a great way for all the people who already make a lot of money from Twitch to help Twitch make even more money. I don't know. There are some things I love about the platform, but there will always be things that I just do not understand. I think we're going to, uh... I don't know. I don't- I don't- I'm, like, aimlessly floating here. Nothing's gonna just wave a flag and be like, Jen, look! Look, this is new! Let's go back, um, I forgot, we have like one other place we can look, I think. Life pro tip, take the cap off your bottle of fizzy water before you try to drink it. Yeah. The biggest surprise in the DLC, big flags that show you all the solutions. Yeah. Hold your hand the whole way. I think we need more, more of a direction. Nothing looks different. We've carefully surveyed everything from far away. I'm 
This flying practice will be useful later. We want to put this here. Oh shit. <laughs> it's fine. There we go. We're gonna run out of time on our loop. Cause there's a radio tower now. That was the other thing they told us, not just the, um, whatchamacallit. And I already forgot because, heck, we're a kid in a candy store. We want to go fly around. Here we go. Go this way, please. Just a little bit. Here we go. Mm-hmm. Yes. Thank you. Boop. We have our suit on. Yes. That was just a lot of nothing to come back to our home planet. Treat your ship much more delicately, delicately than I do. Yeah. I <laughs> I'm not a good reckless flyer. I'm I go very painfully slowly. I forgot how to switch channels. Yay, more stuff. I completely forgot about this. Okay, it's fine. We're too excited. Calm down, Jed. Satellite angle, 137 degrees. Satellite angle, 40 degrees. Oh, is this going to put it in our thing so we can just use that? Probably. Satellite angle, 350 degrees. It still would have been cool if we stumbled upon it. Satellite angle, 248 degrees. If I need these images later, we can come back and grab them. Or these angles. I might write those down. And we're recording. <clears throat> It's been two days since the launch of the Deep Space Satellite, and I'm about to view the first batch of photos. Let the record show that on this historic day, Outer Wilds Ventures has... Ah, they're printing, they're printing, here they come. Stars above, will you look at that? There's Brittle Hollow, and look, look. There, that's Hollow's Lantern, and there's Giant's Deep, and, and the Quantum Moon. I'm speechless, completely speechless. Every single astral body in our magnificent solar system looking stunning from every angle in each of these three images. And in color, no less. Now this is art. I could stare at these photos forever. Doesn't Timber Hearth look tiny from... Hold on. What is that? That can't be right. That's... I mean, that's not even possible. Am I interpreting this photo correctly? What's even stranger is it doesn't show up in either of the other photos, just this one. Well, there must have been an equipment malfunction, I suppose. Only sensible explanation for it. I'll radio Gabbro and ask them to go examine the satellite's lens for defects. Ship log! Unidentified signal nearby? Is it a different...
We had this unidentified... Oh, cool. Okay. Now we have a couple things to go off of. Weird. That's awesome. I was bouncing off walls and exiting while in motion by the end of my playthrough. Yeah. I mean... To be fair, it's like all the way back at the beginning again. I'll get there. We'll get faster. We'll get more efficient. I do like a soft landing, though. It's over here. Despite my checking on them at least a thousand times over, the images are still... Not ready to print over in the radio tower. Well, it's like they say, a watch satellite never transmits data. <laughs> That's just a little joke for you, journal. No one says that. Someday I'll have to study the mechanics of how time manages to slow to a syrupy crawl whenever I'm anticipating something. In the meantime, I've turned to Gabro, our resident expert in leisurely whiling away the hours who recommends the following. Gabro's three foolproof steps for dozing off. Light a nice, cozy campfire and get comfortable. Gaze deeply into the serene warmth. Let time begin to slip away as you allow the flames to lull you into a peaceful slumber. If Gabru knew I'd taken notes, they'd probably think I'd finally cracked, but I refuse to accept sass from an astronaut who deliberately burns their marshmallows. I love it. Can we... Okay. We can doze here. I love how captured how people must have felt when the first space probes in our universe sent back the first close-up images of different planets. Yeah. Waiting for the printer in anticipation. Can I stand on this? No. I can stand in it. <laughs> we. Oops. Now we're stuck. <laughs> what a place to watch the sun explode from. <laughs> we live here now. It's fine. Apparently the earliest rovers to Mars sent data back so slowly that the people working on them ended up just pulling out the colored pencils and drawing a map of Mars while waiting for the data. <laughs> Let Harthians crawl. We need morph. We need morph ball. It says Id unidentified signal nearby. Because it's coming from the tower? Oh, okay, good. I'm glad I got that before our loop ended. I just assumed it was way farther away than that. <laughs> we discovered deep space radio. Wee! Interesting. Last second discoveries! I'm glad I noticed it was still blinking at me nearby. Because I it said unidentified signal nearby. I think it said nearby the whole time, but the nearby didn't click for me until that last moment there. I wonder if there's anything else over there. Slate. Man. 
marshmallow. Um, no. I don't have any big marshmallows left. I still have mini marshmallows from the Mallow stream. <laughs> Reserved for hot chocolate use only though, because, um, you know, they're not fresh. <laughs> Three, two, one, blast off. We're going back to the radio tower and then I'll read the ship's log updates. This way. There we go. Oh, no. Eh, that's fine. Uh, we want deep space radio. Okay. Cool. Interrupt is hi, welcome in. How's it going? Oh my gosh. I, my nerves are starting to die down, thank goodness, but I was a mess starting the stream. I'm too dang excited about this game. And we were talking all about the interloper. Uh, for any of you wondering, other things about it, Interruptus is the one who started it and came up with it, and uh, is the head admin over there, the founder. Fran, hi. Look at all these friends! So many nomads! I'm so glad to have you all here. I just wanted to come back real quick and see if there was anything big that I missed. It seems like we did okay. After wasted, not wasting time. No time in this game is wasted. Oh, I was gonna write down these angles. Should I see if, eh, why not? I was gonna say, should I see if they already come up in the ship's log, but I have my paper right here. Also, if you are new to the channel or not, um, we have a little emote for writing down notes and studying the lore of games. If anybody wants to share it, uh, it's a cute one. <laughs> We've got 248. I don't know. I feel like I'm going to need these later. 350. And I can chart this out, too. We can we can draw a little picture if we want to. Yay. Oh, Kim Chica, thank you so much for the prime. I appreciate it. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Um, welcome to the human race. Enjoy your Earth badge, your emotes, your ad-free viewing. We're very glad to have you. Heck yes. With glasses on the lore emote? The lore emote is a bit emote. <laughs> oh no, I'm sorry. I didn't make that clear. It's our, um, it's our first bit emote in the sequence. Gotta be able to use it. Well, <laughs> I think, do I have it in BTTV? We have a couple that are just in BTTV because I want anybody to use them while they're here. I don't know if that one is. I can check. We can do a quick tab out. It's fine. Uh, hoodie is the one is one of them. Humor is one of them. They like match the set of the little humans, but they're not. Uh, they're just BTTV. Okay. Checked out some of the exciting moments from first DLC vods. Nice. Two forty eight. One thirty seven. Three fifty. 40. Let's go read the ship log and see if that's already in there. Just a little blip. That's all we need. A radio tower designed to receive photos taken by the deep space satellite. There are several photos of the entire solar system hanging on the walls. 
Hornfels noticed something strange in one of the photos, but concluded equipment malfunction was the only sensible explanation. Oh, right, right, right. Okay, I didn't even look at the photos close enough. It's fine. I'm just itching for it. So much. I love you, Bimo. Ring, ring. Hello? Jenny. <laughs> this is Bimo. Oh, hello, Bimo. What a wonderful surprise. Just want to say that I love you. I love you too. Goodbye. Click. Thank you so much for the thousand bits. Enjoy that lore emote. Use the heck out of it. It's a bit emote, so you have it forever. I love it so much. Um, and Bimo loves it too. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for the bits. I appreciate it. It's so useful. All the lore emotes in chat. So one of these, <laughs> a selfie. Are we gonna see? This is a job for a human. Wolf. <laughs> One who's tough, but also empathetic. And has and a, has big, a heart. big heart. Thank you for the 113 bits. Thank you for cheering for humanity. I appreciate it. One of the two sub emotes I have favorited on Frager Face Z. Oh, nice. So we've got Bramble, Twins, Timberhar, Giant Steep. No, Brittle Hollow, Hollow's Lantern, Twins, Moon, Comet, and Giant Scary Shadow at 40 degrees. So then, can I see anything new when I look at this? Yes. As yes. far as yes. Yes. angle of things. Weird. Thank you for the follow. Thanks for supporting a fellow human. Welcome in. Um, how do I orient myself for this? I need to figure out how the angles work, maybe. I mean, if we have them in the same relative positions, we could figure it out, right? If we know... I know, time to take out your protractors. If we know that Giant's Deep is down here and Bramble's up here, you know. That sort of thing. Maybe I can draw it? Abbreviations for planets come in handy. Weird. Nuclear, hi, welcome. Gabbro is very photogenic. Should we go talk to Gabbro again? That's where we started. That's the funny thing. But we didn't know what we were supposed to know yet, and we just went over and hung out with Gabbro to get some peaceful meditation going. This is so strange. Is there anything weird with this one? Bramble, Interloper, Brittle Hollow, Timber Hearth, Twins, Giant Steep. Bramble, Interloper, Twins, Timber Hearth, Brittle Hollow, Giant Steep. Does it matter where the moon is for these photos? The quantum moon is at um, the Twins for this one. 
so weird. Okay, yeah, I guess we'll try to go see Gabbro. I don't know how far along we are. We could meditate. And we can mark this on the HUD, but we don't have anything else we can mark on the HUD yet. Anything new? Three, two, one, blast off. Quantum moon. This is so weird. I don't want to get too far away from everything and drift a bunch like last time. bring this arrow down. There we go. Alright, that's too fast. Let's do this. Oh, space drift, yeah. Oh, what the heck? <laughs> Didn't mean to press that. Sorry! Quantum moon, here to greet us. Again, nice. Slow our entry. It's fine. Don't hit the probe launcher bits. Don't hit the moon. Don't go past it and miss out. But you have to have enough speed to get in here. Okay. I can never remember the landmarks to get to Gabro's Island. Here's the shipyard place. Here we go. The smoke is... you just wander around until you see it. Are you gonna have new stuff for me now, buddy? Spaceship, it's a submarine. Is there anything it can't do? It's a very competent vessel. Alright, hey friend. Um. Found something? Masks. Cannon. Poem! Photo of you in the radio tower. Nice, did I look busy in it? I hope I looked busy. Must have been from the time Hornfell sent me to check on the deep space satellite. They thought old Spacey might be malfunctioning, but I couldn't find a single thing wrong with it. Which is probably how it got a shot of my beautiful, behelmeted face, come to think of it. I always thought it was kind of sweet uh, that the best way to find old Spacey is use a map that's generated by the satellite itself, isn't it? Like it's inviting us to visit. Good old deep space satellite always making sure we know where we're going. Uh, I want to read all these. Hornfels probably told me why, but Hornfels tells me lots of things and sometimes I tune out or pretend there's signal interference and I can't hear them. 
Best guess says the deep space satellite must have sent Timber Hearth some weird pictures, but like, what's considered weird for a satellite, you know? Anyway, if you ever want to visit Old Spacey, fastest way is to jump into your ship and use your solar system map to lock on. Same as you would any astro body. Hello again, again. This is all the same. I mean, the satellite's not super old, but it's hardly brand new. Old is more of a term of affection. You're being very literal-minded about this. Old Spacey likes visitors, you know. Fastest way to find it is jump in your ship. Okay. I'm assuming it's the same... Um, the one that's standard with our spacesuits, the one you have with you at all times that opens with the press of a button? Yeah. You didn't get conked in the head by a rocker meteorite or something on your way here, did you? No shame in that. Happens to me all the time. In case you were hit especially hard, don't forget that you can jump into your ship and use your solar system map to lock to enter to any astro body. It's the easiest way to visit Old Spacey too. Ooh, we're gonna die! Do we have time to get to the ship? Nope. The ship is gonna go away. Oh, uh, maybe. Go, go, go. Yes. But can we not crash? Okay. <laughs> uh, mom's here. Hi, mom. The human. Welcome in. Okay. 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 So we can. I kind of wanted to stay parked for a little bit longer. I was right then in opening my map and looking around while flying out here, but also I need to pin onto it on the HUD, which we looked for it, but maybe it wasn't there before as an option of something to hang on to. I don't know. Um. I don't want to get this far away. Come back, Jen. Okay. I want to get close to what I think this angle is. I think it's within grasp. If I roll and maneuver the way I should, but I'm still like, oh man. Interesting. I think we're too close to the end of the loop. And I keep trying to roll and messing it up. Pratt, thank you for thanking the mods. See you, Giant Steve. Yeah, we pieced out of there. This is so hard to control, though. I do think we're gonna have to do, like, the lock-on situation. I'm not that good for this flying out in space abstractly. Full head tilt. Yep. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That was weird. Right? No? Brittle Hollow's in the right-ish spot. Giant's Deep is in the right-ish spot. We're just going so far away. Uh, Timber Hearth is in the right-ish spot, but Bramble is all out of whack. And I'm going so far away, so I think that's this is not our, our move. But it's interesting to hang out out here. Pratt, have a good one. Take care. Have a good sleep. Weird. 
All right, how do I? We definitely couldn't do that before. Well, maybe we could. I wasn't, uh... Weird. Look at the way the... Sun looks like that. What, why is, what is, what, okay. This is odd. It's a graphics issue. Well, okay. Just let me marvel at it though, I don't know. Like, just let me be confused and I'll, I'll find that out later. Uh, Puffin Suds, welcome in. How's it going? Confusion must happen. I don't want, like, any confirmation or anything. Even if I'm doing something foolish and completely wrong, just let me do it. Please. I don't want to know. I want to, like, I, I want to know nothing about the game as I go through it. I know that's not spoilers, but... Like, I'm. It makes me nervous because I'm starting to ask questions and ponder at things, and those are all rhetorical. Thank you, Chai. Yeah, we're passengers, not pilots. Exactly. All right. Well, we got music, but we learned a lot that loop. away by doing that because I want to uh, what is it called match velocity correctly before I try to come back in we'll see how close we can get by the end here there we go how do I call for a flight attendant <laughs> yeah oh Blinkin. No, oh, no, too fast. It's tiny. Okay, it's tiny like the thing from the Easter egg. Yeah, 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 yeah. Be patient, Jen. <laughs> I hear you. I hear you, son. Just let me hang out for a little bit longer. Is that okay? Oh, we're so... okay. I don't think we're going to make it! This is real cool, though! Oh, there it goes again. It is so tiny. Ooh, what? Okay? Interesting. Chip wouldn't be able to take off because of how many marshmallows have been inhaled yet. <laughs> oh, bone in me too. I'm glad you're here. The loops. <gasps> Slate, you won't believe what we've seen. That death was different. Very different. Very strange. Not sure what's going on. I think that was... I think that was three, right? Because the first one was just Timber Hearth and... Practicing flying and watching the supernova. The second one was... 
wa- flying around floating doing nothing and then finally remembering to go back to the radio tower. And then I think this one was radio tower, Gabbro back out into space. And now we're on our fourth loop. Oh, the first one didn't count. Oh, okay. <laughs> Magus decided. Practice loop. Okay. And table, welcome in. How's it going? Warm up loop. Okay. All right. You're too kind. Um. Let's go. Let's go hang out with the ship. Test loop. Exactly. We. Anything else? We didn't get a notification that there was something else. Wait. And there's no card for it, but you can do it from the other map. Okay. Interloper Discord, thanks for using that link, that command. Tmix, how's it, how's it going? Welcome in. Um, we've got our suit on. I can do this while we're on the ground. If I want to. Can I see? I think I tried to do this and I didn't. You can't get close. You can just see I'm, <laughs> we're leaning. I can see the red bl blinky light, and that's it. Okay. Whew. This is annoying. My player is occasionally stuttering. Weird. Is anybody else having that issue? That's so strange. Twitch, fix it. Alright. Three, two, one. Lift off. Everybody else is good, and refreshing doesn't help in everything. That's so weird. Uh, let's go. To this tiny, tiny thing. Maybe low latency? Could be. Gotten that before where only one streamer has issues. Nope, oh, this way. This way. Okay. still going down, right? Yeah. We're gonna go flying by it again. I'm trying to go so slow, because we kept flying by it before. You're... You're... <laughs> There is another way to get here, yes. Come on, 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 come on! Okay, nice. Gotcha! What? Secrets. Do you hold- do you have a nice little landing pad? You're so little! 
Can we listen to this recording from inside the ship? Oh, and it tells us our angle. Oh no, recording, come back! No! <laughs> okay, it's fine. This is so cool. 65... It's going up, and we want 40, so we just missed what we were hoping for. Uh, but we can hang out! <laughs> We can chill. I wonder then if that's why there's that campsite. But you could just use Slate's campsite. I wonder why they give you the one um, at the radio tower, just for fun. Just because there would have been a Harthian hanging out there. Ooh, and we can hear it. Oh, I need to do this. Oh, yeah from the dish. Makes you feel better, Jen. I did that too, except I hit the recording and the satellite. Oh no! At least I kept one of them, but I know that I can go back and grab it if I need to. I'm determined to chill here for a bit, I think. I need a campfire inside the ship. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I just need to uh, doze at the cockpit for a while. It's so tiny. So have you all done the Easter egg hunt for this game, for the base game? I'm assuming there's new ones. Um, but we found the one that has the little like video player on it and it's tiny like this also. We're at 88 maybe now? Yeah. Retour question, thank you Embellis. Don't answer if there's new Easter eggs. You can tell me if you found some of the base game Easter eggs and maybe just a yes or no and that's it. Good call. We need a campfire, yeah. Uh, the ship is definitely not flammable. It's probably safe to set up a campfire inside. Totally fine. Where is the other satellite dish transmitting to? Yeah, I don't know why we can't um, signal scope to both. It just picks the one. And Antable, thank you for redeeming human kindness. Thank you, I appreciate it. Sending human kindness from me to you, to all of chat. Thank you for being here for Echoes of the Eye Hype. This is super special to me and I'm so happy to share it with all of you. It wouldn't be the same without the Outer Wilds community, without my community. It makes me feel really happy. Um, and you are special and you are loved and I hope you have a great Monday and a great week. It's an incredible way to start the week. Oh my gosh. Best Monday ever. Ooh, don't bonk, don't bonk. I wanted to move and see the angle from a little bit closer, but it's real wiggly. You just have to sit here and listen to the match velocity noise while we sit here. So wait, can I... We can't, like, latch on to this thing and drag it around. That would be bad. We don't want to mess with it. We just want to hang out with it. Thank you for thanking the mods, Exo. Is it a lot of content? Uh, that's kind of spoilers to ask, but from what I've seen- or not spoilers to ask, spoilers for anyone to answer. Um, cause, you know. We don't know exactly how big the DLC is, um, except for the people who finished it. I know, like, roughly how, how many streams people have taken, roughly, but I don't know exactly how long people's streams have been, if they played it off stream. Yeah, exactly, Interruptus. I know, I'm like, uh, no comment. <laughs> I don't know. The answer is I don't know if it's a lot of content or not. Outer Wilds by itself, just the base game, is tons of content. And it's the type of game where you could get stuck, and so you could just stream flying through space and pondering things and testing out your theories and wandering around. Going over your ship's log. We did plenty of streams like that. I know you weren't Antable. I just want to make sure people in chat who know how long it is don't answer that. Recounting the amount of time I thought about the game offline, yeah. 
now I need... Uh oh, next project. Although I don't know how important it is yet, but like... We need a matching model of the... Of the deep space satellite to go with our ship. <laughs> I don't want to know. Yep. I haven't had much time last week. I'm not that far in. Appreciate spoiler-free atmosphere. Thanks, nuclear. We're at 140-something now. I, yeah, I guess I should have maybe started a timer to see how long we needed to rest by the campfire next time, but we're chatting. It's exactly as long as it was intended to be, which is never going to be long enough. Oh, I feel that. At least we have the music out here. Um, so we're chilling. This is way longer, I feel, than uh, what Ash Twin draining uh what are some things we had to wait for in the base game oops wrong way oh. I just want to be able to see you better there we go 171 I, we're chatting, but also I can't say anything I'm thinking. That's what the spoiler chats are for. If you're in the interloper, I have one in there. Um, and if you're in my Discord, we have one in there, too. If you want to ponder things, those are places you can do it without spoiling in this chat. Yeah, there you go. And mods... Um, if you, if you see anybody joining the Human Race Discord, if you could go ahead and give them roles so that they are able to chat right away, I'd appreciate it. I can say plenty of things I'm thinking, I just don't think much. <laughs> Embellus, please. I like puzzles and secrets, yes. I like exploration games, which includes... Mm, puzzle games, mystery games, metroidvania, logic stuff. Ooh, ooh. Got a little excited there. 188. This is so, like, I'm just, I have not much to go off of yet, so I latched onto this and I'm very patient and stubborn and perseverant to just sit here. But, um, there's probably other stuff we could be doing. I could leave and come back. It was just so hard to get uh, to this spot. Oh my gosh, Pup and Suds, we're playing it on Sundays. We're playing The Witness every weekend right now. I'm nine streams in. It's so good. Remember the story of base game? The timeline is super confusing. Um, yeah, for the most part. Like. I mean, <laughs> I know, I don't know, it's interesting to call it a timeline. I'm not, I'm not super good, like, some of our community members of listing out as far as the Nomai, like, what they did first and what order they created things, but I know which locations and which structures do what. Um... I don't know, as it comes up, if I'm confused about base game out, you'll hear me thinking out loud about it, but... What is time, even? One of your favorite games? Yeah, it's... it's... it's so cool. It's right up my alley. We played Myst. Um... I've played Riven in the past. I haven't streamed it. Love Metroidvanias. Love Hollow Knight. We've been playing through Metroid. If you are new today here because of, um, Outer Wilds, I'm recently new to the Metroid series, so I'm also getting geared up for Dread really soon. It's weird to call it a timeline, yeah. Kerbal Space Program we have played in the past. I need to spend more time playing it off stream. T 
225. Okay, great. <laughs> this is so silly. At least, if nothing else, maybe we'll get that cool um, ending again. That weird death animation. I can ramble about base game if you want. I don't even know where to begin. Like, you find out, and spoilers for base game if anybody is here watching this and is still deciding if they're going to play base game, but you find out that the Nomai who existed in the solar system as travelers X number of, what, thousands of years ago were trying to harness the power of... They had the idea to harness the power of a supernova of the sun to shoot off a probe to a signal far, 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 far away that they had coordinates to that was something they latched onto before they ever arrived to this solar system in the first place. And the sun experiment didn't pan out. It didn't work. So they were like, okay, uh, maybe this, maybe we have to start from square one. But then the sun exploded anyway. And it was real sad. Uh, uh, uh. That's not even what happened. <laughs> it does. It is sad, but it, um... This is good. This is good for me to recap. Oop, and I bonked it. Damn it! I got too excited. Maybe it's not good for me to recap if we mess with the satellite. What a waste of time. Okay, we can go rest now. Please go back to your spot! You just want to be able to see the, um, angle of it while it's displaying. And I started talking too much. But, um, the sun doesn't explode. The, everything is set up to launch if it were to explode. But instead, the interloper comet arrives on the scene and it kills everything, which is really, really sad. So all the bells and whistles are in place for this probe to shoot off if the sun were to explode and start this all oh, this whole memory experiment thing to preserve everybody's um, consciousness kind of and all the data and all their experiences that's all in place when everybody dies so when the sun does explode naturally it kicks off this whole sequence and that's where we start how was that did i do okay was it worth it that we bonked the satellite <laughs> Uh, here, hang on one second. Thank you for the follow. Thanks for supporting a fellow human. I saw Machinarium. Oh, Bonin. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I played that on stream a while ago. Long time ago. And I played it before I ever started streaming. I love that game. It's so cute. Played Quern. It was good and misty. Nice. Yes. <laughs> Oopsie. <laughs> Thank you for the follow. Thanks for supporting a fellow human. I appreciate it. Thanks, everybody. It's a tiny bonk. It's so tiny. Uh, I don't have the achievements overlay, so careful on the achievement um, comments in chat. I will see them as I, like, open Steam and stuff like that. Make satellite with no station keeping capabilities a bold move. Okay. We have to do Mallow, and it's- did we get the loop counter? We're gonna have a Mallow and then rest? I wonder if we get there faster though, like at the very, very start of the loop? Cause we got there when it was at 60. And I took- I took my sweet time getting there. But you kind of have to, otherwise you're going to blow right by it. We can try. We can be bold, right? I don't know. I've already kind of messed up here. Three, two, one. Blast off. Hmm. 
yeah, and table. Let the um, we have lots of people who've played through it that know what spoilers are and what aren't, and that's what we're having our extra hands on deck here for today. Um, okay, where are you? Here. Ugh. But I appreciate you looking out for me. Um, let's try this again and see if we can't. I don't know. Ten. Nine. Eight, seven, six, five, four. We should do this, right? So we don't blow right by it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oop, we did. Can I keep doing afterburner or do I have to have it in front of me to do that? Eh. So tricksy! Oop, we're gonna bonk it big that time. Alright. Where are we at? I think I got here a lot faster this time, but... I can't see it. 34! Oh, and the recording! CG, hi! How's it going? Welcome in. Just in time, but we need to... Ooh, flying out here is so tough! I need to, like, spin the right way. And I'm not good with the, um, the roll thing. But we're close enough to it. Okay. Oh, oh, okay. Uh, yeah, um, seems fine. What in the world? But then is it gonna be gone right away? And it doesn't add to the ship log, but we got to see it. So now we should just go ahead and listen to this thing instead of doing the bonking it away. Can I listen to you from the ship? I don't think so, right? We're like carrying it with us. Map offline. Because we bonked it. I need you. <laughs> How are you supposed to listen to this? <laughs> oh goodness. Elias, hi, welcome. Haven't missed a ton. We're only on, what, third loop? I'm just staring at it. Can I listen to you? Bonk! Bonk! This is so weird. We need a bonk counter for sure. I'm like scared to jump out and lose it. You know what I mean? I have beaten the base game, yes. Um, how long ago did we play? This is such a bad idea, but we're doing it anyways. Oh, it's still locked on. <laughs> it's just right up against the nose, staring at it. I love it. Hi. Hello. Please let me listen to you. 
Gavro here, checking in on the Deep Space Satellite per Ground Control's request to check out a possible equipment problem. See, Hornfells? I do too work. You know, I wouldn't mind being a satellite. It's peaceful out here, among the distant stars and the soft, velvety darkness. But it's... Uh, awfully nice for naps, too. Oh, right. The lens. All right, little satellite, let's see what the trouble is. Hmm. Everything looks A-OK, -okay, ground control. No dust or scratches on the lens, and no evidence of sparking or violent explosions. Guess that rules out an equipment malfunction after all. Hear that, pal? You're in great shape. Oh, it got bonked and I was reading it. That's fine. Keep up the good work out here. <laughs> Bye! <laughs> all right. Whoop. Zoop. Uh, we don't have a map anymore. What does that even look like when we fly around? We can still lock onto stuff that we can see. And there's still a little red blinky light over here. It's still close by. Go check it out again. Outer Wild Zero Bonk speedrun. I love it. See? Can we get out and look at it? I don't see that there's a reason why I would want to. Bonk. Weird. Old Spacey was keeping up good work before we bonked it, yeah. So now what? how much that helped us. Where do we go now? I don't even think we got... Did we get a ship log? Maybe we did. Enough time to take a sip of tea. The motto of this game. So now what? Mm-hmm, <laughs> pretty much. If you're not being a slapdash explorer, are you really playing Outer Wilds? Yes, because you can chill on Timber Hearth and have a lovely time with the music and watch the sunrise and set and have some of- what's the alcohol called on Timber Hearth? Sip some mead with your fellow Hearthians and you're still playing Outer Wilds. Sap wine, thank you. I couldn't remember. We're just kind of making our ways towards the sun here. Seems like a decent plan, right? We're still locked on to... Where is the cursor? I saw it for a second and then I lost it. Oh. Sun. It's pointing me to the sun now. No, we're locked on to the sun? Radio tower. Getting drunk on syrup. Yeah. <laughs> Birch sap. Sap wine is a real thing. Cool. Streamer that plays Outer Wilds but never leaves Timberhearth because it's cozy. Exactly. <laughs> I have finished the base game. Yes. Uh, it was a while ago. We were talking about it earlier, but I can't remember how long ago I played it. Maybe... Maybe June-ish? May?
Because it was after Super Metroid, right? And Super Metroid was in May-ish. I, I have no plan for this loop now. Maybe we just meditate again. I don't know. I want to go land somewhere and think. Started interloper end of May. Yeah! Joined during Outer Wilds playthrough, so let me check my sub streak. <laughs> Wooden. Or follow age. I don't think I have that command enabled, though. Here we can listen to everybody play their instruments. Early May, cool. Thanks, friends. All right. Uh, yeah, let's meditate. <sighs> Mid May, since I got the game just after you. Yep, that's right. Loop number four. Hmm. I think I have water too and not just tea. Slate? What's up? How's it going, buddy? Oh! <laughs> I forgot that you could throw the marshmallow if you don't want to eat it. We didn't want to eat the burnt one. Okay. I actually finished a very similar time to you. Oh nice! That's cool, Chai. Number, welcome in. How's it going? Sending thinking fuel. Thanks, Tasty. I know. I'm gonna need it. Have we outed wildly? Yes. We've seen some wild things already. Nothing outed though. A radio tower designed to receive photos taken by deep space satellite. There are several photos in the entire solar system hanging on the walls. Hornfels noticed something strange in one of the photos, but concluded equipment malfunction was the only sensible explanation. So I think we were too busy looking at the shadow of whatever this is to do anything else. And we're only going to have a small window of that 40 degrees. And we're gonna have to turn around and see if there's something we can lock onto. I can't think of a better way to go about it. Oh heck yes, Louie! We, we we took a chance today. That's exciting. Um, if you are here from the tweet, I'll show you the since we're sitting here thinking, I'll show you the I'll show you the three D model. Semi, you're a legend. Ta-da! <laughs> you don't know? Did you miss that part? Semicortex made this and I tweeted it. ta -da. Full cam? You want to see it up close? Do we need this break moment here? I d we were so- you have no idea how hyper I was at the beginning of stream trying to get started and just chattering away like da 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 da, -da Outer Wilds tweet, okay, spo exclamation point spoiler. <laughs> um, I should be able to get to it from this so you can see it a little bit closer, but it's very delicate. Ooh, and it's reflecting all my lights. The ship. No music. K 
Here it is. Two Outer Wilds hype to play Outer Wilds. I know. What is that? How is that possible? Oh my gosh. <laughs> we I posted it. I was like sneakily posted it to um the Nomad's Creation channel in the Interloper a while ago. But um I don't know. It needed it needed more hype. It needed more love. Yeah, it's a 3D print. Going on a coffee run? Okay, have a good coffee run. I must see this tweet. <laughs> no pressure, no pressure. Uh I see, and if I if I sit here for too long and ponder, we have that small window where I can fly to it before we hit the 40 degrees. But otherwise, if I sit here for too long, then we have to sit by the campfire. And also, yeah, I don't know. I wish there was a way to like stop and mark that spot rather than follow the satellite, right? <laughs> I don't know what to do. Let's go sit by the campfire, I guess. Let's listen to Timber Hearth music. What is the, um, what is that thing called? I can't remember. about this game except the screams of Captain Trash Talk. Oh, we don't get to hear music from the map menu. So when we're at 40, I should look at this map again. Oh, this is rough. Okay. Marshmallows are the one true answer, yes. He stumped forever in the beginning, yeah. I know we're, like, you know, I, I'm not spoiled on anything in the game, but I played the base game. I know we're gonna get stuck at parts, so there's really no, um... Try not to put any pressure on myself. I use a model that's on Thingiverse. It's quite a few parts, and some of the overhangs are challenging to print, especially on my cheapo printer. Added a couple things like wires and colored tape to be straps with hot glue. It's so lovely. I feel like we should do another poem reading too, because I'm pretty proud of uh I'm pretty proud of our fan creations. Oh goodness, Timber Heart. You are so special. Don't get discouraged. Love it so far. Thanks, Bonin. Yep. I have the- I mean, everybody who's played the base game, you have the advantage of knowing frustration is normal. Because the first time I played it, I'm sure many of you, when you played it the first time, was just, I was salty on one of the days that we streamed it. I was so salty that we weren't getting the progress that I thought I needed, even though there's other stuff you can go do. But I was fixated on Southern Observatory. I feel like lots of people get fixated and stuck on the platforming to get to Southern Observatory. And I was mad because I kept dying and I kept falling into the black hole. Oh, this is so nice. What reading? The, um,. Outer Wilds poem that I wrote when I finished the base game and then I wrote it on some paper with a drawing and framed it. And then my first ever, my like first and only ever Reddit post is to the Outer Wilds Reddit of my poem. <laughs> the best part of the game is the light bulb moments. Mm -hmm. Alright, let's do... 
Let's doze. For a while. I don't know, five, ten minutes? Southern Observatory was the thing I looked up because I was so frustrated. Exactly. Yeah, well, that is killer. And I, I was nervous about today because I really don't excel at the platforming sections of this game. Those made me really salty in the base game because I was like, I'm not here to platform. I'm here to figure out the mystery. But it's rewarding when you get it. It's just, you know. I don't know. Maybe we'll... I don't want to overshoot. I have no frame of reference for how long to sit. I feel like there's math that needs to be done. And I don't... I don't do a lot of math. I love how the devs did the atmosphere rendering so you can see the faint outlines of planets at sunrise and sunset. Mm -hmm. Ironically, the platform parts were much easier with my new laptop than my old one, really. Did we already mark it? I don't think we did. Uh, can we... there we go. Three, two, one, blast off. Didn't make Brittle Hollow's black hole any less frustrating. It's just it's just part of the journey. What rite of passage, I guess. Best advice I gave myself is not to overthink it and only work with the information given. And don't bite off on wrong assumptions. And if you get stuck, think about what it is that you're assuming or what you're latching on to. This is me telling myself. Trying to. Let's get going pretty quick here. Three, four, twenty-three, twenty-two, twenty-one. We can go faster and then slow down. Oh. <sighs> Ten. Seven. Okay, this is not how you do it, and we're gonna bonk. Maybe. Maybe not. We did okay. That was actually pretty decent. but I don't know. I have no frame of reference as far as angles and math. I feel like that's something I'm gonna have to do on my own time. Because there's gotta be a better way to solve it. Alright, where are we at? I can't see, and I don't want to get too close. Two forty nine? Two forty? I feel like we're gonna bonk it. Doing little circles. Bonk. Nuclear, thank you for the sub. Thank you for two months. Welcome back to the human race. Enjoy your earth badge, your emotes, your ad free viewing. We're very glad to have you. I appreciate it. Uh, 
Yeah, I don't know. I feel like it's dangerous to try to see the thing that tells you where you are. We love some fun manual flying on this channel. Just doing circles around this thing. Enjoy the game and thanks for letting us be part of the journey. Of course. It's not the same without, I don't know, without sharing it. Or like, it's something that you can, how, how to put it? I like sharing it. I'm glad I get to stream it. Not everybody wants to do that, and that's okay too. It's like a personal journey. I get that. But I'm happy to take you along for the ride. Seeing this game for the first time, what would you compare it to? Oh, that is such a hard question. Panda, welcome in. Um, What do we usually compare this to? I feel like it's... Subnautica in space meets mist meets what else? We had a good, I feel like we had a couple good games that we used to mash together when we talked about this before. It's a very unique one. It's like kind of a mystery aspect to it. Puzzles and exploration like Subnautica exploring the ocean, but we're exploring the solar system. Jack's Lantern, hi, welcome. We are in DLC mode. We just started today. Open world space puzzle exploration mystery game. Yep. Subnautica plus Mist is good comparison. I think that's what I remember you saying. It's a good start. I feel like Austin, our friend Austin, has a, had a, a interesting mashup too, and I can't remember what it was that he uses. The lore, exactly. Mm -hmm. If you haven't played this game, you think it sounds like the kind of game for you to stop watching now, you want to go in knowing as little as possible. This is true. It's like Dark Souls? Mm -hmm. Yeah, kind of. I don't know that... How many... I don't know how many chances we get at this. Groundhog Day, yep, like the movie Groundhog's Day, mm-hmm. <laughs> Embrace death and failure, yes. You get to the point where you're just, oh, well, another death. I guess that's Dark Souls-esque, yeah. Not a linear experience at all. The opposite of a linear experience. We're just chilling. I don't know that. Yeah, so we could have waited ten. I don't know, we just could have waited longer. We're learning the timing of when to go. And I'm, I'm content to hang out in space with you all. This reminds me of the streams where I would just hover over um, Ash Twin and wait for the sand to go down and we would sit there and chat. <laughs> Is this our music? So we only get one shot at this. It's just at the beginning of the loop. The target angle was 40. Subnautica without crafting and base building. Mm-hmm. Kind of. It's not a resource management game. You do have to watch your oxygen and fuel levels. Um, so it has that survival-ish aspect that Subnautica has. Like, don't get too far from your craft and or an oxygen source. Um, yeah. <laughs> Music, yeah. I know you should go if you're gonna play it. 
go in knowing as little as possible is 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 so true. Don't don't get this part spoiled for you. You've been warned. <laughs> Are we gonna get that weird graphic again? Are we gonna see something? Should I turn around while this is happening? Probably. Wee! What's out there? <laughs> so odd. There's like still a little bit of dots and blips amongst this strange graphic. Um, it's decently, <laughs> it's decently long. I don't know if you're still here, Panda. You're getting spoils, big spoilers if you've never played the base game. I, I feel like um, for this game, in particular, I kind of assume most people watching have finished the base game. If you're if you're the kind of person that wants to know like a ton of what's happening going into it, that's fine. But the community is like very spoiler sensitive because it's like, oh, we want you to be surprised the first time through. I don't know. I don't know. It's everybody's personal choice. I'm not gonna fault anyone for how they choose to play a game, but um, thank you for the loop counter. I'm like, oh, and I forgot to do the thing again. Uh, okay. Glad to help you make the decision though, Panda, absolutely. I hope we're not being too, like, I don't want anybody to be like, get out of here, leave, but. There is sort a certain magic to it when you play it for the first time. Oh, and thank you for the prime. I appreciate it. Thank you. Welcome to the human race. Enjoy your earth badge, your emotes, your ad-free viewing. We're very glad to have you. I hope you play it if you do. And uh, you, you want to share your impressions, you'll have to come back and let us know what you thought. Three, two, one, blast off. I don't know where I'm going because I didn't put it into my thing yet. Whoops. We have time to at least, like, get our bearing, though. I think. Do we? Can I do this while I'm floating around? That's not terrible. It's up here. Hi! Stream it and we'll watch you. Exactly. If you stream, we will watch you play it. No pressure. A finished base game about 80% done with DLC. Oh, nice! Yeah, so you're good for now. Exactly. And I know there's people here that are uh, close as well, too. Because I'm very... I feel like I'm still very early on. We're still getting our bearing and figuring stuff out. Feel for p folks who can't play due to motion sickness. Yeah, it's tough. It's definitely tough. Okay, don't, uh... Here we go. Don't bonk it. So tricksy. I feel like we went too slow. Nope, I bonked it. Major bonked it. That was so stupid. Did I give it an error? I wasn't paying attention to my numbers. It's fine. I don't know that I did give it an error. I turned my headlight headlights off. That was that noise. Oh, but there's the thing. So we're somewhat sort of kind of where we want to be 
check the map while this is happening. Oh, weird. I don't know, and look behind us? Like, what is my what is my goal here? It's so odd. I don't even know what I'm trying to achieve. Because you've got this small, 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 small window. Is there something I can lock on to? Is there... something here while we're here at least i can get a better idea of where the 40 degree position is i don't know we can always do this again and just keep trying to brainstorm keep cool my babies <laughs> You gave it a concussion. I, um, I did something. All right, we'll get this. This is the puzzling we're all here to see. I know, careful of like the OMGs and the hyper eyes and the like tension, cause that is a spoiler to know I'm getting something. Thank you for the follow. Thanks for supporting a fellow human. I I mean, I know... I don't know. It's so hard. It's so hard. I'm not trying to be... I don't know. I'm not trying to be mean. I'm not trying to push anybody away, but... It's just one of those games. Loop number six. Thanks for the mallow. <laughs> we gotta lock onto it before I launch because I made that mistake last time. And three, two, one, flat off. No emotions. <laughs> I know, I'm sorry. The eyes and stuff, like. Eyes is usually safe because you're you're just attentively watching. Um, it is stressful though because I feel like this is a bit of a time crunch here. Oh, Magus, thanks for uh, thanks for emote only mode. We haven't had that in a while. Uh, this chat being like Guybrush, three put in talking to Elaine. Oh, for Monkey Island fans. I haven't played it yet. I know, I was like, Taw? <laughs> Thank you for enabling emote-only mode. Enjoy! Everybody spam your favorite emotes. Have a blast. Don't hurt yourselves. <laughs> Llama, hi, how's it going? That time we came out here way too fast, but... I think maybe that's a good thing. Far away. Okay, this is looking like a thing. But we want the sun to be a little bit bigger. We don't have to get like right up close to it, we just have to get a good, what, like angle on it. You know? Ooh, 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 careful, Jen. We're getting dicey here. Mm. 
<laughs> Look at all the emotes. I love it. Okay, here's Shadow. Weird. But what... I think we still kind of borked it up. But we get to see so much from here and ponder. Okay, what are you? You're giant, Steve. Why is this like this? Understand. <laughs> Space. I love that one, Mama. Gotta love space, exactly. You know me too well already, looking for my response when Monkey Island are used anywhere. <laughs> when we get to that point. I'm afraid to mess up the angle once we get there. Like, nothing's gonna happen if I just float past and watch a shadow. But... I don't know what I'm looking for. Monkey Island 3 was the first part of the series I played, did the older ones afterwards, nice. I don't- these are all rhetorical questions, um, I don't want any, like, speculation either, even if you haven't played it, cause I'm not looking for hints or guidance or, like, any of that. Love watching people's brains work, it's interesting how people investigate, observe, exactly Jupiter, yeah. I'm- I'm just trying to think it out, cause it's so- I don't know. It's- it's not even- Oh, I did not mean to do that. I don't know how complicated of a puzzle it even is. I don't know what I'm looking for. We're just chillin'. Mm-hmm. Three bees in a trench coat, welcome. I'm seeing some new names today. I hope y'all are having a good Monday. Do we have- okay. Do we- this isn't what I wanted. Another loop. Another death. Do we have anything else to go off of in the log? I don't think so. <laughs> Bookkeeper. Yeah, that's it. That's the DLC. Um... We're at two and a half hours of stream as well. I can't believe we've been live this long. I knew this would happen. Not this long. This is like normally when, when we take our stream break. So, I feel like we will do a little poem reading. <laughs> so I can share that with you all. And then we'll take our stream break. What did you think? Worth the wait? Yeah. James, welcome in. How's it going? Uh, how do I give back to what I need? Okay, so if you're curious, if you were here earlier when we were talking about it. I wrote a poem <laughs> about Outer Wilds, 
when I finished the game, loved playing this game, loved playing it with chat, struggled hard, was very frustrated at parts. I am no, I'm not immune to like being mad at this game and not liking it at parts, but by the end I was sold. I was into it. Um, so this is the poem. I framed it since it's going to reflect all the lights, but I did a little ship drawing some, you know, there's a tree, there's a campfire. The eye is there. I can read it again. It's not as like, oh, I don't know. Let's just read it and see what happens. Okay, ready? Oh, and you'll see why we made our stream title what it is. Harthian hearts know my minds. Human hope forever change by our finds. From brambles dark to ashes core. Picking up pieces, still yearning, lore. Fear was there, we scrambled for breath. Another loop, another death. Patience endured and science was king. Don't forget to be curious, brave hatchling. The travelers now can rest again. Music and mallows at glades. End. That's the poem. I'm so proud of it. I'm such a nerd about it. Okay, so if you never got to hear it when we finished the game before... <laughs> oh my god, interrupt us, I know. Uh, second complimentary <laughs> poem reading for you all. It's very special to me. It's how I met some of my closest friends and um, some very special people in my life from this game, from this channel. Ah. And I don't do a lot of poetry or fan stuff, but I get to open up with that, open up to you with that. Thanks, friends. So with that, um, I think we'll take a little stream break. I'm gonna grab a snack. Maybe like, I don't know, refresh my brain. Think about something else besides 40 degrees and shadows, and then we can come back and see what else I get into. Um, maybe have a quick, like, brief uh, mod chat as well. See if there's anything we need to address. Wanna make a quantum poem generator website? I love that. It was such a heartwarming moment to hear it last Mallow stream and now again. Love poetry, thank you for that. Of course, of course. I'm glad you like it, Fran. All right, stay tuned. Thank you for being here. I appreciate it. Stretch if you need to, grab a snack, get some water, uh, all the things, and I'll see you in a couple minutes. Hello, humans. Welcome back. I hope you had a nice break. I was working on some mod things, wolfing down a snack, getting ready to get set up. If you had a stretch, whatever you needed to take care of yourselves. I hope it was lovely. Uh, Jim, welcome in. It's good to see you. Let's switch back over. Hi. <laughs> and uh, we'll get our game music going again. We'll get the game set up. I um, I didn't have any epiphanies over, over break, if you were wondering. But we'll do our best. Um, we just woke up, right? I have to do the mallow. It's a tradition, but it doesn't have to be super roasted. And then I think, I think we're just gonna have to head right back and I have to do a better job of this and figure out, and figure out what's happening. <sighs> we have to mark it. Oh, I can't mark it from that view. Oh, it's so... Okay. Three, two, one. Last off. And it's up here. We're gonna get good at flying to it, at least for this section. I 
feel like anything over 500 I have to watch so carefully. 500 meters per second because we can go flying by so quickly. I think it's all right. Such an odd little tiny thing here. Okay, we were pretty quick. And now we know... an angle, and you can't see the, um... Oops. You can't see the red light when it's got the sun blocking like that. on to you? Are you just a shadow or are you a thing that I can go visit? Can I only see you if I go hang out with the satellite first? It just says sun. Are you another quantum thing? Are you a shadow? It's so weird. We're 20 kilometers from the sun. see a donut, yeah. We're gonna get weird music? What's happening? Is it getting quieter? This is so strange. Yeah, we are losing the music. And just hearing afterburners. Oh, what? Wait, 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 wait. No, frick, no, okay, sorry. Oh, this is so nerve wracking. I'm just like forever squinting at what appears to be just a big old eclipse. Weird. But it looks like I can see stars through it? This is so strange. Oh, okay. Well, that's new. Excuse you. This is one of my other 
signals do something here? No. Ooh, new music. Oh, this is very strange. What are you? Are those ships in there? Is this where we gotta... Oops, that's not what I wanted. Roll and park? Um, uh, what? Hello? Okay, hi, what's up? We have our suit on. Oh, it's so quiet. Okay, we have the scares on. If we need to turn it off, um, we will. Okay, there's my flashlight. No emotions. <laughs> oh, goodness. Oh, weird. I was too afraid to take a look at our surroundings as we were flying in because I didn't want to miss out on whatever is in here. But this looks big. And I'm like now wondering, okay, how much time do I have to mess with this now that we're in here? Can we read this? No, unknown language. Huh? Oh, I'm so afraid something's gonna jump out at me. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Or, and also that we're gonna run out of air. Is this kind of like a, a ladder? Can I go up through that? <sighs> What's the scariest thing that can happen? I don't know. I didn't know that the other game, the base game, was gonna have, um... anglerfish, but they managed to find a way to make me very scared, so. What's, um, gravity like in here? Zero. It says, oh, okay, nice. It says zero, but, oh, 1.3. Was it because I was already using the jetpack? Yes, 1.3. It's so dark. Okay, not, there's not a whole lot in here, so it seems. And this isn't a thing down here, right? So we either have to maybe... Oh, what? Excuse you. Rude. I can see better now, because I didn't have my flashlight on. I, ha I thought I turned it on, and then I think it turned off. Is this like an elevator? It's not bad. If I'm looking at it, it moves. If I shine my lights on the blue things, they move. Is this how I came in, or is this a new spot? I think this is how I came in. Yeah, 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 yeah. The ship indicator tells me that. Weird. Okay, there we go. <gasps> Oxygen, nice. Oh, and when you shine your light on them, they all... Oh, weird. What is this over here? Rotate. That's all that's in here, right? We What? Whoa. 
What? Oh, I have a little boat? Wait, I... <laughs> I need to stay on said boat? What do you mean I have to keep up with this thing? And I have to not look at it because the little lights make us go in a direction. Can I... If I get under this, can I go up again? Yeah, it'll lift us. Whew, okay, stressful. Ugh. I'm like afraid to look at any of these lights because then it'll... We'll miss stuff. What is... What, what's that? <laughs> Excuse me. What are you? Where do I update my, um, you know, thing that reads things to me? Ship log updated. Pick up lantern. It's, uh, it appears to be broken, but we can take it with us, sure. We might need it. This is so cool looking. Look how beautiful it is. Oh goodness. Mods, thank you. Sorry. I don't, um, we're just letting mods do their thing. And if it looks suspicious, they will bop it. Um, Llama, we have, we have friends that you can ask to if it's a spoiler or not. Uh, that I've beat the game already. But yeah, if it, if it, if it... If it looks suspicious, they're gonna just go for it. Just in case it's a it's a spoiler. Oh my god. Does this pass? I'm afraid to go out here because it's gonna drop us down. But I don't know if it'll pass. Not a spoiler, we're all genuinely confused. I think we saw something that we was like not normal for the game. I think it was a glitch or something. Yeah, I get that, but best to leave it neutral. I know, I know, you all are doing great. Mods, you're wonderful, I appreciate you. I don't know if this will pass. I'm gonna run out of fuel. But I feel like it's gonna water level is gonna come down and we're gonna crash and die. What's in here? And why am I still holding this lantern? Oh, scary! Uh, hello? Owl people? Maybe we're just, maybe this is just our life now. We're just underwater now. I mean, we can, we can, we can't swim. We have a spacesuit which helps us to survive underwater because we're only partially aquatic. Is this above the water level now? Yeah, what are you? Already holding lantern. Lantern does not fit. Can I put lantern down? Not while we're swimming. Weird. Owl people. <laughs> Ooh, it's a pretty shade of green. <laughs> Alright. I've had enough of this. I don't think the level is changing anytime soon. Let's get up on here if we can. Nope, current. Alright, boat then. Boat is our option. Owl people with boats. Ooh. Cool music. Can I get can I not get over there because of the current? I wanna go over there. Yeah, no, look how strong the current is, you can see it. What is this? Whitewater rafting simulator now? What? I thought this was a space game. We 
if you ever see pictures of owls without feathers, they're mostly leg. <laughs> this is so dangerous. I feel like we're just gonna end up crashing in the rapids. Can we get up to this thing? Ship log updated. We're getting some updates. No! Gravity is unkind. We thought we would try it. Okay, well, I do not like the raft thing thus far. I'm sure we'll get used to it. Weird. And there's like an underwater path there that maybe at some point is open. Can we make this maybe? Yeah. More owl people. Oh, these are nice little paintings. And we're still holding a lantern this whole time. Something about camera motion is getting me now that I'm aware of it. Okay, good uh, to bring up. Heads up for anybody, this game is a little bit wonky if you're prone to motion sickness. A lot of first person uh, perspective and moving the camera all around. So thanks for bringing that up. Made, made a warning for witness stream. The one for Witness Stream, I think, was for... Oh, yeah, no, it was for... You're right, it was for Motion Sickness. Ooh, that's pretty. Okay, I'm gonna put this down. What is our... What is my goal? What do I want to get to? That building looks interesting. That big light looks interesting. That building looks interesting. gonna fill with water. I don't know. It's like a lodge. We can rotate. Used interface? I don't know what this does yet. This is dangerous. Just turning dials. Not knowing what they do. Lanterns. Lots of lanterns. What is this thing? Does the lantern go on top of it? Yes. Hmm. Trav, hi. Wanted to stop in, say hi, leave a lurk, because I haven't played Outer Wilds yet. Uh, hi, I'm glad you're here. Leave in a lurk. And yeah, I understand. Totally cool. Thank you for redeeming human kindness. Sending human kindness from me to you, to all of chat. Thank you for being here today. Thanks for all the hype and experiences experiencing this game for the first time with me. And uh, it's good to... It's good to know you. It's good to have you as a part of the community. I am very... <laughs> <laughs> distracted, I apologize. Looking all around and trying to figure out what the heck is going on. Llama, thank you for the motion sickness warning. I appreciate it. And there's our music. Ooh, what are you? Remove slide. Oh. We need a lantern and a slide reel. 
cool. Now does this do something? We're missing like something to make it more focused or like a lens or something like that. Music brings me back, yeah. Definitely llama. Can we do two of these at once? I'm racing against the music. No. I don't want it to be over yet! Wait, what was that? Oh, you can just barely faintly see it? It's somebody's- it's an owl person's face. You see that? Is it because my flashlight is on? Weird. I don't get it. Oh wait, now my flashlight is off. Ooh, hello! <laughs> I'm like frantically trying to do as many things as I can before we run out of time so we'll have lots to read when we get back, hopefully. Now we're cooking. Now things are happening. Double fisting, slide reels, party is just starting. Hello, owl person. Oh my goodness. So yeah, we saw some interesting sights. I feel like there was a lot of uh, a commotion. This game though, do we have to like, pause immediately upon waking up every time? Cause we always have to go back to that spot, but we can spend a loop reading and then we can meditate. What do you all, oh my gosh. Mm. The world needs more Outer Wilds music. Yeah, totally. No comment, I know. Uh, we have to have a mallow, we just have to. It's tradition. If you all are in, um, I hope you're making use of the spoiler chat. That is a place where you can all hang out and say all the things and like question what I've seen and uh, ask each other like progress. Hey, hold up a sec. Yeah, I already know about the launch codes. What? No. I was going to tell you about using the ship log to set destination markers for locations you visited before. Okay. It's a brilliant feature, if I say so myself, dead useful, and the risk it poses of shorting out the fuel regulator and causing the ship to explode is so minimal that only Gosen, Gosen knows, uh, would worry about it. Is this game backseating me because I never use the ship log to, do, to mark my location? <laughs> I know how to do this. <laughs> Slate, you waited four years to tell us, yeah. Bought a banjo recently, and guess what the first thing I played was... Mm-hmm. Many people had no idea it even existed. Huh. Okay, so they added it. Gotcha. I mean, they added this dialogue. Um... How minimal are we talking? Minimal! Stars above, you worry too much. If anything's gonna kill you, it's the autopilot. It's true. Wow, Slate. How do you come up with these incredible ideas? Oh, I do the best I can with what I've got. Really. You're too kind. Ah, <sighs> Timber Hearth. I like these, um, dialogue options. Slate, you're a technological marvel. This was extraordinarily convenient timing. Thanks. That's not what my voice sounds like. Everyone's a critic. Anyway, I've got a fire to enjoy, and you've got launch codes to grab go wild with the marking feature while you're out there. Just, uh, try not to follow it so directly you fly into the sun. Okay? Thanks, buddy. Active spoiler chat is in the interloper discord. Come join to follow Jen and others on their playthroughs. Thank you, Ta. I wasn't sure which one would be more popular today, so we did, we went ahead and, uh, 
advertise both, but it's up to you all where you want to convene to talk about me. <laughs> but also join Jen's Discord. Thanks, Interrupted. <laughs> okay, the stranger. There it is. A massive artificial ring would ring world hidden within some sort of cloaking field. It does not appear to be Harthian or Nomayan in origin. <laughs> Look at it, it even makes the thing blink. Is that new? Don't it make I don't I don't know if it's spoilers to answer that, but you know. River Lowlands, a low-lying region near the entrance to the stranger. There are wooden buildings along the banks of the river. There's definitely more to explore here. I've never read anything quite as pointed as streamers, like the voice line option of my voice doesn't sound like that. <laughs> they really wanted people to see it. They really want you to know. Yeah, exactly. Hey, Red Wolf. A pair of small rocky islands connected by a village of stilt houses. Cinder Islands. That was something... We swam past... We floated past a lot of stuff. So now is this going to give us... Hopefully a better angle to set this up. So that I don't have to go the long way every time. And I don't have to... Because we don't need what's it to be there old spacey to be there every time i'm gonna head out in case you start discovering more than i've discovered sounds good jenny thank you for being here i i totally get it and i'm excited for your playthrough too stay curious have fun <laughs> we've already got this marked so let's head there weird three two one blast off I need to head to bed. Happy time zone to all the humans. Have an amazing rest of stream. Thank you, Wooden. I appreciate it. Have a good sleep. We will see you around. Um, let's go visit. That's the Addle Rock. <laughs> but do we... I'm curious what this is going to look like. I said, oh, we don't have to line it up every time. But I wonder what it's going to be like coming at it from this other angle. Echo, how's it going? Welcome in. Oh, we it gives you the marker, but it doesn't automatically lock on like when you do it from the map. Okay. I'm, yeah, I'm really curious. I feel like I have to come at this from this other direction. Okay, we're, uh, <clears throat> no, Jen. <laughs> it's okay, sometimes that happens. We're, we're cruising now. At least get down to zero and I can work with that. Also did that way too many times. You mean not lock on and just fly towards the little arrow? Oh, unbuckling? Yeah, that happens to me all the time. It's just keeping things spicy. Okay, so it, it just helps us get there without... Um, Regar wherever it is, regardless of where old Spacey is, it, now we have the marker. Good. Love it. I guess I'll use it. I won't try to manually fly here every time. How does that sound? Oh my gosh! Naked beer ice. Cory, how's it going? Welcome in. Thank you for the raid. How are you? How was your stream? What were you working on? 
Oh, and Robbie! Double raid! Immediately back to back, heck yes! Oh my goodness, friends! Okay, first raid. Uh, Outer Wilds, are you working on the DLC? How's it going? Are you working on uh, role-playing stuff for Outer Wilds, what, tabletop game? I'm gonna pause. Two raids at once. Hi, friends. And Robbie's here, too. Thank you for coming in. How's Stardew? That sounds so lovely and relaxing. Thank you for those shout-outs. Thank you for those follows. Thanks for supporting a fellow human. Oh, my goodness. Welcome to all the raiders. I'm Jen the Human. If you don't know me, I love exploration games. Metroidvanias, puzzle games, and this is my first day on Outer Wilds DLC. Huge spoilers if you do plan on playing this game. I just want to throw that out here. Working on DLC a bit farther in than you. Had to ask chat where you were to make sure I didn't accidentally spoil myself. Yep, yep, absolutely. I'm glad you did that. We um have only been into the stranger one time. I think that's fine to say because you're farther than I am and your chat helped you out. But I won't say too much more than that. Thank you for the raids. Thank you. Stardew's fun getting the hang of controls and doing a lot less accidental gifting. <laughs> nice. This is your first time playing Stardew? That's awesome. Oh, I wish I could play Stardew for the first time again, too. Accidental gifting is such a mood at the start. Yeah. Um, Samfiz, Sky Collective, Sequoia. Again, thank you for the follows. Welcome, everybody. If you're not following Naked Beer Ice or Robin Crow, please go check them out. Lovely humans. Send some support. First time! That's awesome! It's so wholesome. Uh, I'm gonna keep... We're, we're at this moment of diving in, so I'm gonna keep flying. This is a job for a human. One who's oh my goodness! So empathetic and has a, has a big, big heart. heart. Chai, thank you for the 350 bits. I appreciate it. I appreciate you. Thank you for cheering for humanity. And uh, I have food coming, so I gotta raid and run. Of course, yeah, no worries. Enjoy your food, relax after the raid. If anybody came in from the raid and needs to take off or lurk or um, just chill, I get that. I appreciate you being here. God, this is so weird. I feel like I messed it up. I'm drifting. Oh, there we go. So we can explore our surroundings in this big open thing a little bit. It's like, this is the cloaking device. What happens if we, ooh, ooh, too disorienting. I don't want to look out. I'm just going to continue along my way. Uh, roll the other way, please. We're rolling. Mm-hmm, we're rolling. And we're popping in there sideways. Eh, it's fine. I want thank a tiny you, ship. floating whale to give me some fin. Llama, thank you for the 42 bits. I heard there were new alerts. Can I find one here? That is not a new alert, but it has moved around to make room for some other alerts. So um, I hope you enjoy. That is our 42 bits alert now. It used to have like a wider range that it covered. All right, uh, let's do this again. I wish I could read you. Oh my God, Ta. Thank you. Thank you for the gifted subs. I appreciate it, enjoy that Zelbest music. We are, <laughs> we are working through, I've been trying to work on updating some alerts. That one's still the same. Thank you, Ta. Thank you so much for the gifted subs. Um, that one's new. Anger, <laughs> hatred, revenge. But I am not mystified by the desire to be loved or the need for friendship. <laughs> These are things I do understand. Thank you for the 500 bits. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. Gosh. Uh, welcome everybody that got a sub to the human race. 
enjoy your earthbad, your emotes, your ad reviewing. We're very glad to have you. Thank you for the bits. I really appreciate it. And what else? So much hype! I don't know what to do. I don't know what to say. Thank you. I'm gonna try to open this door in the meantime. Ooh, I think we were close, but not quite. It's like I gotta get the top one only? No? I feel like I got lucky. That's the way we came in. Weird. Oh, I don't like this. There's a good way to do it. The awkward data kiss, yeah. <laughs> Enjoy those human, very human alerts. We love data and BMO and uh, cat bug. But we're a very human channel. Wait, did I get turned around? I did. Oopsies. All right, here's our boat. Now we know what's happening. A little bit more than last time. Thank you again. Enjoy those new alerts. Um, I'm trying, like I said, I'm trying to, s to swap them out slowly. Every time I go to work on alerts, I end up staying up way too late at night, changing the tiniest little things, so. Quinn, enjoy that sub. We can stop here again. And we know at some point this particular spot is going to go underwater, maybe? Is this new? This is like a map label thing. The tree up there. Let's go to this. Oh, this is where we were before, but yeah, it filled up with water. Yes. Yes. We went to the right inside that building instead, I think. Thank you for the follow. Thanks for supporting a fellow human. Welcome in. This is such an undertaking to get in here every time. Did we read these? We did look at these. Hmm. I'm already doing repeats. That's not a good sign. I don't think I came over here fast enough last time, maybe. Or is this where we picked up the lantern? We saw this portrait. Oh. Wait, what are you? Some kind of sun and moon thing, but it didn't say it added to our signal log. Is this hooked up? No? Because I don't think there's a... whatchamacallit in it. We gotta put a lantern and a slide thing in it. <gasps> it's just stairs. Weird. Oh, here's one. Will you help us? But I don't want this room to fill with water. No, um, thank you, Scout, but I'm good. Why does that thing keep spinning? Oh no! I'm not ready! Oh, here's a cool new portrait. Scary. Oh god, we're getting swept away before I can get to the surface. Don't like, don't like. Level 7 popcats, yes! Oh, rotate? You're gonna let me... 
No. That was weird. I think I bumped into it. I don't think you can just jump out of the water into one of those. I don't think it works like that. again. Oh. Swimming. Dying. We get pulled under? Yeah, I think so. Oh, stop it! How did we get out last time? I don't remember. This is not cool. Don't like this at all. The rafts are one thing, but when you're just swimming around, you're like completely helpless. Here, can we get out over here at least? And we went over to that thing before. <sighs> oh, come on, Jen. Can I get over there? Maybe? We're just gonna end up swimming. But we've got these railings to assist us. Yeah, yeah, it's fine. Hello, that is the eye of the universe. What's up? What you doing? Is this fuel? Um, that's fine. That's not unusual at all. Possible spoils in the conversation. Ooh, um, careful. I'm gonna be cautious in reading all of the messages just in case speculation about stuff or I, I don't know better better to not say anything in case it, it ends up spoiling something I'm not sure we've like barely seen anything yet so I haven't put much together is this a lantern? no where else can I get to from here? Should I try to go underwater? Oh no, that just goes to the riverbed. It's not it's nothing personal, Sam. It's it and or anybody. It's it's not um it's not like, oh my gosh, how dare you? It's just keeping all speculation out of chat so I can discover it on my own. Not all speculation, but like we're we're doing um we, we play better safe than sorry, just in case something is a spoiler or confirm something, you know. Yeah, it's not it's it's not like, oh my gosh, I'm going to track you specifically because one of your messages it was was deleted. It's just uh, to keep it. Keep things moving. Feel free to have the combo about your own playthroughs out of chat in case I read some of it. Yeah. I don't exactly, like... Okay, here, can I get up on this thing? I think so. There's certain parts where they give you a ledge to get out. There's another boat. It's moving way too fast. Because I probably... Can I get, like, one of the lights on it to... No, I'm too far away. Spoiler chats are great for that. I know, yeah, exactly. That's the place to do it. That's why we have them, is so that you can participate there and not miss out on talking to each other about your playthroughs. Nice, Jen. Um, but this chat is pretty much like, huh, I don't know, Jen. Who can say? Huh, that's kind of odd. 
I don't know what that could possibly mean. Alright, let's try this again. We've got more things we can use. Ooh. I have not figured out how to work these properly. It makes a cool noise. Pretty colors! There's an owl face. There's another one. So how do I see... Everything that I want to see. If I take it out and put it back in, then at least we can see the eye again. Everything's fine. Can I launch? Can I? You're too bright. Oh, and it's already the sound again. I didn't do anything this loop. Standing on the roof. And that's, there's just two of these down here, right? And they seem to have like one main image on them. And then a bunch of other, like, images of, I don't know, stars or something? There's the image on that one. <sighs> Redbeard, hi, how's it going? Uh, thank you for the lurk, Chai. I appreciate it. Have a good lurk. What happens with the, um, the supernova in here? Anything cool that I can see from where I am? No, it just, it like stops you in your tracks. Gonna wick to, uh, gonna microwave some lunch. Okay, sounds good. I think we got at least a, um, ship log update. I don't like how fast you have to move. Or like, the fact that if you fall in the water... That took- that took up so much of my, um... So much of my loop, just wasting time swimming around. I feel like time moves faster in there. <laughs> Good luck! Thank you, Overthought. The DLC looks amazing! It's really cool so far, albeit 
has its frustrations, like the base game. Wait, did I not eat it? I just put it away. Mallow. I just threw the mallow on the ground. I didn't mean to. This is so strange. Hey, Sir Pantero, how's it going? Thank you for the resub. Thank you for the seven months. Enjoy your earth badge, your emotes, your ad previewing. We're very glad to have you. Welcome in. Uh, I thought we got a new thing. Yeah, a pair of small rocky islands. I found a large metal symbol for the eye of the universe inside a burned out building. That's it. That's it. Our one thing. <laughs> yeah, I didn't mean to throw it on the ground, but here we are. Three, two, one, blast off. Oh, I guess I don't have to turn that way. We can just go straight up here. And get away from Timber Hearth and face the correct direction. Uh, I'm kind of dis disoriented, but... Yeah, we're messed up. We're going into the sun. I'm really disoriented. I hear it. It's fine. Sun death happens. Unless I can get out of it. I heard it. I was so close. Are we still close? I think so. I hear it. Thanks, Red Wolf. I like flying in this game. I'm not the best, but I know how to get around at some kind of a pace that works for me, so. <laughs> and you have unlimited fuel. <laughs> Which is great. Sun in your save game is hungry from a lack of ships. I know! It's like, I remember you! How come you're not... catapulting into the sun? There we go. Who came up with this? Let's not, like, catapult inside, but we still have to make it inside? I never- I've not been paying attention to how fast I want to fly through there. You can run out of fuel, it takes a really long time, and a glitch maybe? Well, we're not gonna do that. Uh. Hey, Bellis, how's it going? Welcome in. Thank you for the raid, I appreciate it. How are you? How was your stream? What were you working on? Can I get a shout out for Bellis, please? Let's see if we can get through this door faster this time. Oops, I was standing in it when I tried to operate it. Been playing Outer Wilds, but I believe I'm further on than you. We are on our first day, so uh, it is possible. I don't know. I did, I, you can do things out of order, too, but I don't think I've seen a whole lot yet. Felt safe to raid, yeah. Thanks for coming in. It's good to see you. Welcome. Hi, raiders. I'm Jen. Uh, I really like Outer Wilds. <laughs> 
and it's day one of my playthrough, and I haven't figured out this door yet. Fully. Uh, 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 oops. There we go. You love it? Like in the DLC so far? Nice, nice, nice. People following your progress in Interloper, yeah. Heck yes. Okay, ready for a boat ride? No, never. Should I just try to stay on this thing longer, maybe? And not pass under that one spot that lifts us up? That could be helpful, right? Can I go around it? I can. Maybe we'll go over here. If we can. And now there's one here for us to use again when we're done if we want to, if I don't accidentally make it float away. Oh, maybe this is just a spot for you to hang out and get a ship if you don't have one. Have we been in this part? This is all going to get flooded, right? We can get closer to, like, the cloaking device here. It made a noise. Okay, it's fine. Is that... Oh, I don't want to be here. This is gonna get flooded. We're like right by the thing that's flood gonna flood, I think. Do we need to go explore those trees? I don't know. I feel like we're gonna die on this loop from crashing into rocks. Also, I don't know how much... Like, there's a lot of, of water. How much deep diving and swimming do we have to do in this game? Uh, Garrett, you got gifted a sub! Enjoy that sub, enjoy your emotes. Uh, thanks for coming in to thank Ta. Glad you're here. As you probably know, coming from Outer Wild Stream. Yeah, we're keeping it hint free. We have a spoiler chat for you to hang out and, and talk in if you would like. Um, but otherwise, no. Really, no game information. We can talk about what we did today, what we had for lunch. <laughs> And, uh, oh wow, isn't that interesting? I have no idea what that part of the game means, Jen. But, trying to keep it free of any suggestions or stuff like that. Yeah, Bellis, you get it. Mm -hmm. Oh, I thought I had that. It's fine. Well, this is something new, but I don't know that there's anything that I need over here. Maybe I did want to go back that way? Oh, there! Oh, I tried to click the button like in um, the witness to still the screen right here so I could use my cursor to show you. Oops, wrong game. I do kind of want to go check that out if I can survive it. Parkour. Nope. But I think... I don't think I can... Nope, 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 nope. Don't go back in the water. Okay, now you can go back in the water. Maybe. Or did I beat you completely? <laughs> it's stuck. Ooh! Maybe when the water... Hey, there we go. The Witness Outer Worlds crossover! My brain wouldn't be able to handle it. Looking for lines and circles. Seriously. 
All we know is there's more to explore here. Mm -hmm. That's it. That's the gist of it. Oh, the music is cool. Oh, are we gonna survive these rapids? We're gonna try. Maybe we can get up on top of, uh, this thing. Ooh, nope. Nope. Jen, that's... Okay, well, that's good. That's what we wanted. Can I get under there? You gonna let me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Best raft music ever. Really good raft music. It seems like people uh, who watch out our wild streams tend to have better than average understanding of rhetorical questions. Yeah, I appreciate it. Well, just because there was a dock here doesn't necessarily mean I want to stop, but we're going to try. We'll give it a go. I think I can, uh... Oh, ship log updated. Broken bridge. Bridge is out. There's more to explore here. Hmm. Trees. Alright. Anything under the stairs? No. Not those, at least. No. I don't think. Can we make it across to the other side? Is there a dock over there? Oh, there's a beach. We can try. I don't think so. I think I would have had to have chosen that as my path instead of over here. Oh, maybe. Go, 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 go. 50% fuel remaining. There's another boat for us here if we need it. Oh, but I don't think we can do anything because there's a li the little, there's the other side of the broken bridge. Okay. We want the other boat then. Hopefully this one is also functional. Oh, it's not in the water as much. <laughs> it's, uh, well, here we go. surfing. It didn't work for us. It didn't work out. Let's see if we survive this. That looks like a beach-ish over here. I'm gonna try for over here. Seems safe enough. Oh, ship log updated. Okay, good. Now maybe some jetpack to help us stay safe. Whoa. Oh, interesting. There's a dock, but the water level is too low now. Weird. Oh, 
All attempts at surfing are surfing if your definition is, did the water push you along? It did, and then we had a wipeout, so, you know. Certified surfing. That looks like there's another, um, one of those picture things on that broken dock that we might have to go down and retrieve at some point. The sun looks very red. And here's an actual functional lantern. But we don't have a slide reel. Oh, come on, Jen. Okay, so you can't you can't use these without a functional lantern. The one the rooms with the broken lantern give you an idea of what the picture will be with your flashlight, but the best way to do it is with the working lantern, which makes sense. I just hadn't seen one yet. And if I had, I walked right pa past it and didn't grab it. Do we have time to go down there and grab that thing? Can we survive it? I think we can survive it. I don't know if we have time, but we can try. A pretty straightforward path to get there. No, he fell. Well, rip. I think there was a little. Yeah, this broken thing through here. Can I fit in here? Can we crouch in this game? <laughs> yeah, when we do this. Sequoia. Thanks for the lurk. Thanks for coming in with the raid. I like those dex emotes. <laughs> Let's see what this is a picture of. And we did have time. Okay. Show us your secrets. It's a projection thingy into a weird looking thingy and the eye is on the right hand side and there's a planet on the top and there's a lantern-y looking thing on the bottom. There's like a burnt thing and these are all scary and burnt. Creepy. Oh. People making a thing, making it bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger and lowering it down into the water. Sadly, I've got to go sleep. Oh, no worries, Velas. Of course. Have a good have a good sleep. Thank you for the raid again and no spoilers. Definitely not. Oh, and then we're back here. Interesting. Ship log updated. I don't think that I went through here before. There's one of those things again. or something? I hear noises. How do these work? Okay, so you make it eclipse and then the door opens. I did not know that. Do I need to be over here? This seems dangerous. Okay, goodbye. I 
I wonder... It didn't update our, um... Ship's log. To say how to open those doors. That would have been kind of cool. Here's a antler staff. I think I want to try to go back down before we run out of time. It's so dark in these buildings, but it's so bright. Out in the wa out on the water. What does this sign say? Is that a sign for the dam? Okay. Oh. No. Oh. This is the thing. Is this where they lowered the thing from the picture? No, that's across the way. I see it now. It's across the canyon. Is that giant chain thing that we saw in the slideshow? But what is what is this over here? And is there a way for me to open this door? Oh, and there's like pipes on the ground. And there's our music. And these are, some of these are the same symbols. No, the only one I think I saw was the planet looking one. Huh. Don't know what to do with that yet. jump in here just because we're almost out of time. No? Was this a mistake? Oh, fuel level critical. Well, that's fitting. This is so weird. I don't know what to make of any of this yet. Oh, now we can finally get to this part that I saw earlier. And was wondering if we could walk across all, all of some of this tall stuff. No, sun. Don't end my loop yet. I gotta get faster at walking through here so that we can see more stuff. Oh, that looks wild. Does that update our ship log? No. Oh, okay. There we go. I was like, when is it going to stop me from moving? Uh, Pausanias? Welcome in. Hello, fellow human. Quick water break. Hopefully we have a lot of ship log stuff to read. I feel like... <gasps> I feel like more so than the base game... Where, where were places I was always rushing to get to in the base game? You want to get there quick, quick, quick. Anything in the... What is it called? The underground city? The one that fills up with sand? I was always rushing to get there and see as much as I could before the next loop. That's how this feels. I'm just like... How can I get there as fast as humanly, hearthianly possible? So that I can see more before before the time is up. There's too much to see. You gotta be methodical and break it up into chunks. 
So you're not like looking at the same stuff over and over again. Cliffside building, reservoir, burn slide reel, submerged structure. That's a decent amount of things. An enormous reservoir with wooden piers and buildings on both shores. There's more to explore here. A slide reel that shows a strange vault being encased in a large metal structure and lowered underwater. Nearly all the slides have been burned and cannot be viewed. According to a slide reel, a strange vault was encased in a large metal structure and lowered underwater. I saw a building marked with a unique symbol recessed into one of the canyon walls, but the bridge that used to lead to it had rotted away. Oh, too much. Oh, um... It's gonna stay marked every loop. Okay, brilliant. I think that had already happened in a previous loop, but I hadn't made a note of it. Have to go pick up prescriptions. Don't do too many fascinating things without me. Talk. We'll see when you get back. Three, two, one. Blast off. It's so weird not immediately turning away from timber hearth and like I, sh I should still do it because of the thing we ran into last time with the sun I don't know it's so odd what happens if you try to go into the stranger from the other side you just bonk into the window should we find out Or is it- because we've never tried to go all the way through, if that makes sense? I just always end up landing in there. We still got the music, I think- yep. <laughs> Can you imagine playing the base game and you're flying around and just all of a sudden, like, completely, um, crash? What is damaged? Just the hull? Yeah. Can we get to where we're going first? I think it's fine. Sorry ship, I will repair you once we get inside. But we were doing some science. Some scientific crashing into the side of the stranger. <laughs> We're in better shape now. Oh, that's so strange. It never gets not unsettling. Thank you for the follow. Thank you for supporting a fellow human. Welcome in. Outer Wilds. Mm -hmm. Outer Wilds DLC that we've been waiting for and waiting for. Oops, hang on. I'm trying to go into this little entrance. Tilting my head while doing it. Oh, nope. Come on, Jen. You got this. There we go. And that's fine. Good job, ship. Suit is on. We are ready to go. Uh, can I get to the repairs from here? Aha. Maybe? Not really. Yeah. <laughs> okay, good as new. Bye! I feel like with this game more so than- with the DLC more so than the base game, I should be writing more stuff down and drawing symbols, because so far 
the uh the ship's log hasn't really given us oops yeah okay pictures of things that I've seen that I wanted to keep pictures of now what is our plan how far do I take this raft Can you go the other way when you start out? Uh, yeah, kind of. Is there anything over there? I don't know. Let's just go this way. We have less time because of scientific experiments crashing into the side of this thing. I don't know that it was worth it, but it was fun. past here. Treacherous rapids. I think we'll just try to get back to where we were and go a bit farther. Play any other games with time loops? I don't know. I don't think so. Hi, Mr. L. Welcome in. Uh, the power goes out. Weird. We've been here before, let's keep going. This is the part we were trying to surf through last time, uh, but we swam. Oh, and this- okay, now this is full of water. Because we got here sooner. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Let's go over to this side. Please. And thank you. Mm, whoop. Up, please. Only I can think of are Zelda Majora's Mask and Deathloop, the new one. Yeah, uh, I've played Majora's Mask a little bit. <laughs> this is like no entry, no access point. Can I? Can I just? Whoop. I haven't played Deathloop. I've seen like a couple clips of it so far. I'm not super into first-person shooters, but it looks like people are really having a good time with it. So do we want to be... we want the water to go down here, right? The opposite problem. Oh, I can't open that from here. Interesting. I've watched quite a bit of 12 minutes. Oh, 12 minutes was interesting. I saw a little bit of a playthrough and some commentary on it. Uh, heavy, heavy game. So do we just watch? Oh, there's like a symbol up there too. Do we, do we just watch everything break from here? Are we gonna break? Is this a pretty dangerous spot to be? Should we find higher ground? Look at this symbol on the side of this wall. We've seen, I've seen this center thing that looks kind of like a circle inside of a circle, but I don't know that I've noticed everything around it as well. Interesting. Heavy stuff, but super interesting, yeah. Oh, there's a- there's a dock there. 
I don't think I want to be on top of that thing. But now have we done a full circle all the way around this place? I think so. Oh, look, you can see. I kind of want to watch this happen. It's going to be loud. There's also a ghost trick which contains several mini loops as opposed to one big one. Huh. Lots of cool loop games, yeah. Mm. We're out of water. Circles and lines. Outer wilds, not outer water. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Hope you have a lovely rest of the stream. I'm up and teaching master students at 9 a.m. Okay, Fran, take care. Thanks for hanging out. I appreciate you. Uh, and thank you, Wolf. Thank you. Please no spoilers or information or tips or anything. You just get to sit back and relax and watch the struggle. Seeing if there was anything on top of that railing there. This is so cool looking. The whatever, the cloaking, the fact that this is just sitting here all the time. They made an, a Discord just for us. Outer Wilds Pilgrims! They did indeed! Yes! It's not a speedrun, no need to get everything right the first time. Seriously, yeah. Bone in, take care, have a good sleep. Good night, good night. Good night to all my time zone friends. And good morning to all my time zone friends. <laughs> Outer Wilds leaves players in a really unique state. Mm hmm. It's tough because I know streaming games on Twitch, you think, well, you decided to stream it, don't you want people to help you, or don't you, like, you have to expect that people will comment about what you're gonna play, which is true, you do take that risk, and I get that, you know, if, if we don't catch everything 100% of spoilers at all times, like, yeah, sometimes it happens, and they get through, but I was gonna watch it happen and then I was too far away. Um, oh wow, that looks wild. But for this game, for things where the whole point is to puzzle it out and figure out the mystery on your own, it's like, yeah, but I still want that experience for myself, even if I am choosing to share it. I still want to try to figure things out on my own. Because uh, if I wasn't streaming it, I would be able to to just chill and go at my own pace and mess up and start over. I don't think we've been through this side of the canyon yet, but that all gets destroyed when the dam breaks. Okay, good to know. And things are happening now. Here we go. Won a bunch of BAFTA awards. I think whoever made the damn claps deserves a whole new award all for themselves. It's so neat looking. And now we can see a bunch of stuff down here. I wonder at what point, at what minute mark, the dam breaks. Uh, I don't want to know yet, but that's something we can time later if we need to. How did I get up here again? Oh yeah, I jumped up on this roof. Uh, 
unauthorized access. Oh, we lose? Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm glad I went up there, I guess. Does this door open yet? No. Are we too high up then to, like, explore down there? Should I just go for it and jump? Probably. We're in Halo. Is that what the ring looks like? Yeah, I guess we're gonna go for it. Pretty okay with my jetpack, I guess. But I don't think there's anything for me to... to get to with that. There's like a little island down there. Oop, oop, that is not a surface I can stand on. There we go. Should we try to get to that? Should we jump in the water? Ooh, look, look, look. There's an opening right there. some fuel. can only imagine the complexity calculations for stuff like space travel for Brittle Hollow. Oh my gosh. Is this like a TV screen? Those aren't pipes, those were electric cables. Oh. Weird. You have to come in from underneath it. There's another lantern over there. I'm probably gonna want it, but maybe I'll just leave it for now. <laughs> oh, scary. I'm actually going to sleep now. The Noclip documentary talks about simulation behind the scenes at length. It's, yeah, the documentary is so good. You don't need to imagine you can play Cripple Space Program. True. Pretty sure the game is constantly doing pretty complex physics calculations. Okay, yeah, I read these in the wrong these comments in the wrong order. Uh yeah. Uh 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 bravery fine. I didn't have to land on the hard surface if we're going in from underneath, but I think the current is moving too fast. Actually, that's not gonna work. I can get a closer look at it. like glowing? You see the, those little like light uh, lit up dots? That's weird, right? Okay. <laughs> uh, dang, I wish we had a boat. Boat, come over here. It'd be cool if they make a mini documentary about the DLC, yeah. They wanted to lag your game to hell and back achieve- wait. Yes. They wanted to lag your computer. Okay, um... I don't know if the current's gonna sweep us away into those scary bits of wood. But if you... So I wonder if we have to get here when the water is still... The water level's still high up. You must, because then there's not this drastic current. 
Oh, we can try. I should have just tried. Oh, that's fine. Noises. Noises! Ooh, and a flame. You can roast a marshmallow. Maggie, thank you for the host. I appreciate it. Weird blue mallow. But we don't know... We can doze off? Do I want to doze off? Is dozing off here like dozing off everywhere else? Yeah, seemingly. Although, I got scared pretty quickly. Oh, and there's our music. How's DLC? It's good, it's weird, it's... I don't know. It's, uh, there's so much to do. There's so much to look at. There's so much new stuff. Am I supposed to shine these at this? No. And this is all underwater still. Is there anything else down here? I don't think so. <laughs> Wee. Overwhelming? A little bit, a little bit. I'm feeling much better than I did at the start of stream, though. I'm not nearly as jittery and <laughs> hyper about this game as I was at the very beginning of stream. Alright, so we, um... Oh, there's so many... I almost want to go back and watch the VOD after stream today and go screenshot all the things I didn't draw and I didn't write down. But I don't know that how that would help us here. I think we just saw a picture of these symbols as they are currently. It doesn't look like it can affect them. It's very strange. It seems very important. I feel like some that it does something while it's underwater. And this metal thing above it protects the flame so that it stays functioning and lit while it's underwater. And table, we were talking about that earlier. If imagine if they combine those games, if there were if there were environmental puzzles in this game, I would lose my mind. Um okay, we are going to take a quick water break. And maybe bring the cats in because I want to stream for a bit longer but I do think it's a good time for us to sit back and relax and chill for a second and I and my water is empty so we got to do that uh, here mallow first oh <laughs> double cat cameo can one mod redeem or refund another mods channel point redemption <laughs> you should be able to right did the same but it was out of stock yeah i think there's only two per stream because i only have two cats and i don't want to summon them continuously all stream long all right let's do this uh cat cameo let's see which cat is nearby to hang out with us
sorry. I had to run and get treats. I didn't have any in here. Here's Bibi. Here, yes. you want to say hi? Yes, yes, what? yes. Thank you for the follow. Thanks for supporting a fellow human and a cat. Here's Beatrix. She was snoozing. Duncan's on his way in here. I just heard him. Her little cross paws. She had a, a nice long nap. <laughs> Are you comfy? Is that comfortable like that? Crispy, hi, welcome in. <laughs> Oh, she saw Duncan was on his way in here. I'm gonna give them both treats. Hang on. Oh, yeah, look at the camera. Good job, BB. Meow. Hi, Dunk. Come here. Oh. And this is my other cat, Duncan. He's, he's, he's a bit bigger. <laughs> he's a person, too. Double cameo. Since you both redeemed it, we might as well show both cats. You don't have to redeem another one. Um... We're just gonna hang out with both of them. He's a soft boy, yeah. They're both very good and love snuggles. Okay. Who wants treats? Ready? Someday I'll get a better cat camera set up, but here. Baby, where are you going? Do you not want these? Do you wanna jump up and show cat? Duncan's not having it, but you can see his little mouth, his little gremlin mouth. Here, come on. Jump up. Oh, good girl. And you can have this one and this one. Okay. That's enough cat treats. <laughs> okay, well, <laughs> they're a little bit of a chunker, but that's kind of extreme. <laughs> Alright, thanks, friend. B, you did so good. Um, we are going to take a short stream break just for water and, uh, I don't know, quick stretch. And we got to show off the cat, so I will see you all in a minute. Thanks. Welcome back, humans. Excuse me. I hope you had a good break. Um, let's get back to it. I just got to hang out with the cats for a moment and, uh, grab more water. Here's our game. Oh, that's not our game. That's some yellow flowers. <laughs> Here's our game. What are we trying to do this time? We had our mallow. We want to... I think we want to do the same thing, but try going in the water. And seeing what happens if we go in the water sooner which is um scary did we get did we add anything yes submerged structure sealed vault a large metal structure suspended by chains it can be entered by swimming from below there's a sealed vault illuminated by green fire inside the structure i found a strange vault wrapped in chains and marked with three glowing symbols oh interesting it doesn't say there's more to explore here, but that's not always, um, a thing. And then this is the structure. Okay, so this is something I wished I had screen captured, but that's fine. It's on here. Um, let's get to it. Three, two, one, blast off. need to do a better job of flying to the stranger but setting up the sun angle better like first go because I keep <laughs> well I don't know we're doing just fine I think I don't think there's a way to be bad at exploring in this game you just explore <laughs> It's really interesting to- okay, I kind of overshot there by a lot. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. 
how intimidating this is from the get-go with the um, observation satellite. You're like, dang, I have to do this every time? Like, how am I ever going to get good at this? And how am I ever going to get fast at this? But they really want you to use your ship log. Like, it makes it so much easier than setting it up from the... satellite. Okay, alright, here we go, here we go, nice. Nice. Taking the scenic route. Yeah, that wasn't so bad. That worked out. I think that was pretty good. We're getting quicker still. And in we go. so cool how they um how the music stops like that oops i keep pressing the other bumper key to roll come on come on there we go it's fine everything's fine nope 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 it's not <laughs> Jen, please. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm sorry, ship. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> I heard the bad ship noise. Wait, what? wrong door or maybe that one just shut the other door oh, I hate this thing I feel like I'm getting it from luck every time okay uh, we can also go instead of going to the underwater place we can go on the right side of the canyon, because we have not seen that yet. Hmm, I'll think about it on, on the drive over, on the float over. Going so fast! Go, 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 go. Oh, but it's gotta be... I think you kind of have to be more premeditated about the fact that you want to go over there because now we're... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. You have to decide way sooner than that. I am I need to get over to the right. You might even have to switch to a different boat. Raft, whatever. Oop. Okay, alright, we're fine. Everything is okay. I love this music. The music is very good for the raft sequence. Super cool. I wonder if we can, uh, hang on go back over there through this? Like, is this thing powerful enough to get us inside of this tunnel? Oh, that looks very dangerous. Maybe let's not. At some point, I want to go over there, though. weird electricity stutter. We've seen that three times now, I think? And heard that noise? 
Uh, thank you, Mons. Uh, please, no any infor no, no information about future stuff that's gonna happen in the game. Um, even if it's music or like atmosphere related, I want everything to be a surprise. So thanks for understanding. All right, should we di do we dare dive in? We haven't done any swimming yet. Scary. Uh, very scary. This seems really scary. But I wanted to see what it looked like while it was underwater. Oh, okay, because it looks the same. That's fine. Because of how water works, it looks the same. I avoided track listing. Yeah, like track titles. I remember when we played this the first time, people were um, saying maybe avoid track titles just in case. Is there anything else down here? This is very hard to see. I don't like it at all. Good thing we have that little, what, attitude indicator. Just a little frog swimming around in the, in the reservoir, hoping to find a safe spot before the dam bursts. Gotta head out now and do afternoon things. Sounds good, Chai. Thanks for hanging with us. Take care. Thank you all for understanding. You're all so good. Um, if your message gets deleted, there's no need to worry. I'm not like making a list of people that have that have had messages deleted. It's just precautionary, so. They finally had your meds ready. Oh good ta. Do we- are we kind of stuck here right now? I'm in a weird spot. I don't know that I have anything else I can jump to. I want to get higher up. Which I think I can once the water drains. It's gonna be- it's gonna be loud again. <laughs> exactly, I'm not making a list. I'm not checking it twice. I'm not Santa Claus. Oh, I guess we can go under there and sit. We could have dozed by the fire. But I didn't know I wanted to do that until I came back out here and realized I couldn't really get to anything else. Or so it seems. Can I climb this tree? Come on. Can I stand on this tree branch? Ooh, there we go. Does that help me in any way? Yeah. Nice. Higher ground. Um, we've seen the other side of the higher ground over there, though, right? It's just that one part of the canyon that we haven't been in. I don't want to try- oh, all the lanterns just turned on. They're flashing. Weird. I don't really want to try crossing this bridge knowing that it's about to- everything's about to break. Can I go this way? Back the way I came? It's gonna be loud in a second. The dam is very loud when it bursts.
Hmm. It doesn't appear that we can come back from this direction. It didn't give us any nice jumpy platforms. I could get back in this boat though. We can go around again and do another loop. Do you think it's safe to be on this thing when it bursts though? Oh, but this one's too high up. Oh, it's too high up. If we wait. I don't know, this is an experiment. Oh, we've got a little time after the burst because it has to travel all the way around the ring. So I think we'll be okay. Can I get through here? Oh, but now all the stuff I want to explore is broken. And now there's a current, so I get it, I get it. Um. Cool. It's so weird, the first time you come in here you have no idea what you're looking at, and now I'm like, ah. Eh. I've kinda, I've kinda got my bearings a little bit. There's a building there. Oops, sorry. Sorry, tree. We got stuck on you. Ooh, okay. Alright. Abandon ship. It's not that I have super have my bearings, but it's that we know we're in this weird ring structure now. We didn't know what we were even inside of before. fast is the current here? Can I do anything? What else have we not seen yet? Lots. Tons. A million things. Is that above water? No. There's a sign though. And this island is above- oh there's a boat! <gasps> Come back! Alright. Nice! Can we go back this way? But how do- I want to keep this boat with me. I don't think I need to be over here. This is that weird painting room, right? This round one? If we caught a boat like that, we can catch another one. I know, I, I obtained it and then I immediately abandoned it. But I don't know where I'm taking the boat to. the painting room again. This has... Oh, what? Oh, that was weird. Nothing happened. It just went dark for a second. This has the planet and an owl person looking at the planet. This has an owl person riding on a raft. This has an owl person with a musical instrument. An owl person fishing? 
and an owl person with their eyes aglow and some candles. Hmm. There's another boat. A normal owl person doing normal owl person things. It's bird person. <laughs> here. Is this just a path to get up again? Yeah. Don't mind me, just walking around with my lantern. Do 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 do. Going around in circles. The sun's looking very cold and red. Harvey Birdman, attorney at law. What is that? Oop, what is that from? I almost just jumped to my death. I want to know what happened to these owl people. Look at that hole in the tree. Interesting. I think that's just what the tree looks like. And did they all go poof the same way that we all went poof? Well, we go poof every loop. Or were they wiped out? There's no ghost matter here. Which is interesting, right? They have a vault. Did they try to make a memory thing too, like the Nomai did? Let me up. Adult swim show? Oh, gotcha. An old one? Gotcha, gotcha. It's a law firm staffed by superheroes and other Hanna-Barbera characters. The trees look like swamp monsters. Yeah, the trees are really, uh, really cool looking. I like their the design. Well, we're kind of killing time. I can meditate if I want. Um, how much parkour do we want to do? Because we can walk along these outside ledges for... Oh, the tower falls? Oh, it has like a structure on top of it. Interesting. Have a pun to kill time? Yeah? You've got a pun for us? Our music is about to start, I think, so... I don't know, what else do I want to see? Before the end of the loop. I wish I could get up there. I saw the news today, it was about a tomb they discovered in Egypt that was filled, oop, hang on, with hazelnuts and chocolate. It doesn't want me to climb there. They believe it <laughs> belonged to Pharaoh Rocher. Oh, number. <laughs> I like it. Yeah, I don't think they want you to go up that way, which is fine. Who level critical? Sun level critical. Uh, I don't know. 
I'm kind of just roaming aimlessly, but that's okay. We'll get there. Let's jump in the water. Whee! Going for an end of the loop swim. Goodbye. Hmm. So now we're gonna go back on our little raft. And there's that spot where it splits and there's a left and a right. We're gonna try to go to the right, but we gotta get over there sooner. So we might have to switch boats, which is fine. Lucky loop 13. We'll see. We'll see. Hi, Slate. Mallow. Nom nom nom. Did I miss cat cameo? We did it before the break. Yeah. The cats were on. We're on camera, both of them. I don't- we didn't have anything new for the ship vlog that time, right? Oh! Cool! I don't think I've stopped to look at what it looks like on the- on this view yet. Say hi to BB and Dunk for me. I will! You'll probably hear BB meowing at the door. She says hi back. Three, two, one, blast off. Oh, I didn't mark it, though. No, it stays marked. Every loop, I forget that it stays marked on the HUD. But I'll get used to it. It's only the first day. to match velocity and get a little bit closer. Let's just start out here and go in while setting up this angle. Or at least trying to... Oop. Don't get too far away. Uh, I did a better job of it last time. A much better job of it. Oh well. There we go. This should be good. Should be good. Nope. Okay. Maybe I won't crash my ship this time as we're trying to get in here. Wait, I rolled the exact opposite way. Roll, 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 roll. No! I did better with it the first couple of times, and now I'm all over the place. And... settle. Bonk. Let's go! Oh, let me sit a little comfier. It's so cool that this is all, um, the thing that gets you to come here is just that one 
little museum exhibit. That's it. And now we're doing all of this. Going this way. On a raft journey. Do we want to do... Oh gosh. So we're getting over the hump of like the first day confusion a little bit. A little bit. And jitters. Should we start doing predictions and stuff for this, for this DLC? Do you all want to do like... Oops. Uh, well. Uh loop and death and ship log type predictions or should we wait and do that a different stream I don't know I'm open to ideas wait have we never been no because this is gonna be that same round building right we just need a new boat let's go grab this one over here There isn't one. It's fine, it's fine. Uh, where, there's one on that little corner over there. Is that gonna be able to get us to the right hand side? I feel like we need to go through this channel right here, but I gotta decide fast. Or we could swim through the right hand side. No wait, I'm turned around. Just kidding. I'm very turned around. That's okay. It happens. It happens to the best of us. Uh there's one. isn't after the base game for a new player it's a tough thing to do as a dev yeah because some people will be will have it from the get-go I I really want to once I'm done with this want to watch a playthrough like that where you have the whole entire game available to you oops 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 don't jump too far Jen uh, right from the start That'll be so cool to see how people deal with that. Can we not, uh... Am I too heavy? No? Oh, there's our weird power flickering. That's so strange. Okay. Oh, I don't know if we're gonna make it. We have to get so far over there. Oh, maybe we just go through this way? This is the stuff I wanted to see, I think. Can I jump on this from the other side? There it goes. Nope. Interesting. Uh, for an open world game DLC, but this is the first I've had to consider uh, with mystery like this. Yeah, the new exhibit is probably going to be the first thing a new player will see going into the observatory now. You have to keep in mind everything you already learned, though, to even get here. I just, I don't know what that's going to be like for somebody that's brand new. And that will be cool to watch for the first time when I get a chance to. And I have so many VODs to watch. <laughs> so everybody that played, that's uh, modding, that played before me, I'm like, oh, I want to see what you did. Okay, well, I think I made a wrong choice by coming over here and not bringing the boat. But I got nervous. Are we surprised? No. Can I at least make it to that shore over there? Should we just swim for a little bit? We can make it to this shore. I wish this light would lift us up even if we weren't on a raft. 
I think we're gonna run out of time. I think the dam's gonna break. Is this a ship log thing? No. Go, Jen, go, Jen, go! Could barely fly the ship in the beginning. It takes- it takes practice, it's no joke. It's not- I don't know, it's just- you gotta fiddle with it. You gotta get your sea legs. Ship legs. Why does everything have these same pictures inside of it? And lanterns. And this tower is going to tip over. How do we get to the top? Lanterns are good. We like lanterns. But what else? Show me your secrets. Drop down and sink into your flesh. No, okay, I don't want that. Whatever I said before, I um, I didn't mean it. This is weird, right? What's happening here? Oh, I put it in the wrong spot. It goes here. Ooh. Pretty. What does it mean? They sure turn off your flashlight a lot <laughs> to use that thing. I mean, they have to. It has, it, it has us exercising good flashlight discipline. Yes, no, maybe, I don't know. Good answers. We've been in this room before. It was informative, supposedly. There's like cool decorations and stuff everywhere. Oh, is there something up underneath here that we have to get to? Should we just go for it? Should we jump down there and look? Because that's kind of what it looked like, right? And we don't have much time. is not helping me. The water here seems to be pretty murky and whenever I try to turn my flashlight on underwater I'm like I can't tell if it's on or off. Oh. Staircases. Dripping water noises darkness. Creaky stairs. This is taking us to the top of the tower before it topples over, but after the first dam break, this doesn't fall over. There it is. Um, it falls over later. Ship log updated. Ooh. Pretty. And we get one of these with a new symbol on it. Although I don't know what's being 
washed away or what's gonna put us underwater? I didn't think the whole thing broke at this point. Maybe I misinterpreted it. It tilts now. Ooh. Whoa. Weird. So this looks like that other drawing that we've seen with... Oh, weird. There's the thing underwater that has power. What are these little poles? This is a place I don't know if I've been in yet, or is that the entrance we came in? That has power, maybe, I don't know. This is where we are now. The tower has power. And there's four of them, kind of like that other drawing we saw. Leans to various sides while hanging on like he's on Star Trek and the ship just got hit, yes. Oh, this is very interesting. So now, how do I get down from here? Can we just jump? We're pretty good with our jetpack, right? I think the way we came in is going to be flooded. I don't want to swim out because of the current. Whee! Eh, fair. It does tilt. Okay. Can I view this in here? Oh, yeah, we can. Maybe. I don't have a working lantern. I feel like this, um, this whole game... This whole area, these slide reel things, is a matter of remembering. Okay, grab a lantern that works from here, bring it here, set it down, now continue, come back with the slide reel that you want. Because they don't give you- it's not like the text scrolls in the base game where they just conveniently have it pretty much always nearby where you're gonna read it. Oh, but there's lanterns in there, right? In this room also? Yeah, there's a bunch. Never mind. Forget everything I just said. I'm thinking it- I'm- I'm overcomplicating it. Surprise, surprise. Yay. Owl person? We're following them. There's a song or something. Oh, it's creepy music. Is this gonna be the glowing eyes owl? Yeah! Oh, this is scary! Maybe. Glowing eyes. Like the statues almost. Showing us. Oh! Pointing. 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 We've got a cool bracelet. <laughs> Taking a lantern. Walking away, and the painting disappears. Ooh, that's the thing from the other symbol! Weird. 
everybody's going into the respective buildings that we saw. Oh, and that's the end. And this looks like the symbol on the door of the tower, or like the outside wall of the tower. So what happens if you take all the light away from that room? And what is this other thing that they're holding, that spiky thing? Oh, it's on the top, it's on the, all of the buildings. Ship log updated. Scary! Aren't there other, um, slide reels in this room? Is this the one that has the flooded basement? I can go down and grab some more? No. Mm, maybe. I can't remember. Doesn't look like it. I can't make up my mind. It does have a couple. It has a few. Can we get through all these? This is super interesting. This is the blue thing we saw for the vault. It's the second symbol, maybe? Oh, this is scary. I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like it. His little head is poking up. They go into it and it lights the flame. And that's the second one. So this is showing us how they locked it. I haven't seen the slide reel for the top one yet. What if I watch this one in reverse? <laughs> that's so weird. To light it, they like walked into the flame with glowing eyes. God. Okay, let's look at the other one. If we have time, if we can. Oops. Oops, come on. This one? Okay. Okay. That thing at the bottom is the thing they're holding. The one on the left hand side is the vault. The one on the top is the planet we saw in that picture where they walked into the painting and now we've, we've got the eye. Owl people observe the eye. They're holding a staff. The staff lights up. They cast glowy lights at the eye. Oh, they scan it? That's kind of cool. Oh, hi. You've got a flame. It looks like you're looking into a projector, maybe? And you see the eye glowing red. turning red and then you see the eclipse. There's our solar system. Is that what happens after the sun explodes? Oh, creepy. The music's so good, yeah. And time passes and passes, and now the flame turns 
blue. Oh, that's so weird. Oh, I don't like it. It's so weird. Okay, okay. Are they like seeing a vision? He had a vision. He's upset now. They've seen too much. Their eyes are aglow. We burn down the eye shrine. Weird. And then we lose some slides, and now they're locking something away in the vault. Because they don't want that to happen. They don't want to see everybody die and their skeletons and all their feathers fall off. Because it's scary. Ooh, and what's... What is this cover? You see there's like a thing... Like a gear in the... Corner there? I don't see anything in any of these. And here's our solar system. Oh, what? It's not a gear. It's that. Is that their ship? Is that the ring? That's not, that's that's what we're in. That's the um stranger. They went into hiding. Oh, what? Okay, I have a can I ask a mechanics question? Does time stand still while we're doing this the same as when we're reading text? Just yes or no, safe word, one of the mods, if you could answer that. I think so. Yeah, okay. It seems like it. Because we've been here for a while, and I would like to sit here for a little bit longer. So they, they have this blue glowy light, they scan the eye, and we're having a vision from that. With blue glowy flame. Something about them, I don't know, worshiping the, worshiping the eye? Understanding the eye? Seeing the eye? They see this eclipse vision and everything dies. Wish I knew that before rushing through them. Yeah. Oh, you're good, Tell. Um, Tell, Tell Naor? Sorry if I'm saying your name wrong. I think, because of, of base game, I didn't know it at first, but it's nice to confirm that so we can hang out. Telna, thank you. Thank you, thank you. Um... Yeah, I would be shocked, too. Oh, the music's so good. And they burn this down, and now we're gonna get the burnt slides again. Ugh. Showing stuff about the vault, I think, but we can't see. And then this shows, like, make maybe building the stranger? building the ship that we're in. And then our solar system and putting it into place. Okay. Alright. It's a lot to take in. And ship log updated, of course. It's been lo lovely hanging out, but now I really need sleep. Of course, Llama. Have a good sleep. Rest well. Thank you. Thank you so much for all your help appreciate it. The audio cues are so good. Yeah, if you hear end times, we'll know we're wrong. True. Yeah, it's easy. That one I don't mind asking for mechanics stuff because, you know, we'll find out soon enough. Ooh, what's that a drawing of? Anything else in this little library closety place? No? I want more slide reels. This goes, like, out into the river, right? I don't think I want to go out there. I think we'll get swept away. 
maybe. I don't know. I think I have to sleep. Garrett, take care. Have a good sleep. Thanks for hanging out with us. I hope you get some good rest. Game audio is so good, I want to leave it so loud when I play, but also so good it spoops me too much. Is it? Is it pretty quiet for you all? Is it loud? I feel like everything just sounds like um, water rushing. More so than the music, but... If we need to make adjustments, we can. I feel like there's more to do in some of these structures here. Or maybe there's more slide reels hidden inside of them or something like that. What happens if we take all these out of here? Ooh, it already is scary. I don't even think I have to take all of them out. It like changes a little bit. It's so weird. Oh my god. Ah! Uh, oh, it's falling. It's making the noise because the tower is falling now. Okay, bye. Bye. I thought it was something with the door. Ooh. Audio's fine. Okay, thank you. Electric welcome in. How's it going? That was a lot. Let me go over here. Oh, and there's our music. And here's the burnt down eye building. Well, we'll pick up some fuel. We know that that's in here. Oh god, I'm having like the witness moments with negative space looking through this arch. Sorry. I did I picked two games that I probably should not be playing simultaneously. What's underneath this building? Have we seen that? Is it just cliffs? Oh I did I did go down this staircase once before and then noped out of it. I don't know that there's anything down here though. Oops. Here's this sign again. Okay, that was very interesting. Very informative. Good loop, Lucky 13! That was a very interesting loop! We did a lot of platforming and jetpacking, and then we were rewarded, thank goodness. I don't really know what to do from here. I think that's plenty. We can just let the loop end. I say as I continue to walk around aimlessly. I should have maybe tried to stay in the tower after it fell. I was just kind of scared, so, you know, we, uh, we exited the premises. Picking up fuel while well, music is playing, I do that too. Well, you know. Had a couple times where I caught myself doing that in this area. Definitely didn't experience that with base game, but something in here triggers it more. DLC in Subnautica is not a good idea. <laughs> we are going to be playing Subnautica too, but I might have to wait a little bit before we start. I think the next big Sunday game that we're going to do after The Witness is Subnautica. Um, but there's gonna be, like, a significant break in between. Oh, looking for witness puzzles. Yeah, gotcha, Ta. Mallow and, um, loop counter, if we can. Thank you. Yeah, Subnautica. It's gonna be very scary. Island Tower, Cinder Isles, and then there was another reel. And that's it. But maybe there's... 
Well, let's see. A pair of small rocky islands connected by a village of stilt houses. I found a large metal symbol. A slide reel that shows the stranger's inhabitants analyzing the eye of the universe. Several sides have been burned and cannot be viewed. A tower that sits atop one of the cinder aisles. The upper floors can only be reached from a second entrance at the back of the tower. I found a slide reel that shows the stranger's inhabitants opening a secret passage in a round room filled with lanterns and murals. The inhabitants are shown filing into three of these rooms throughout the stranger. I wonder then... We saw the different symbols of the different buildings. And we saw the different symbols of the different paintings, maybe? I don't know. We're going to have to like match buildings with paintings, it seems like. What's this one? Oh, just more to explore in River Lowlands. Yeah, there's a heck of a lot more to explore. Um, oh my goodness. What's my goal for this loop? What do I want to try to do? Pull all of the lanterns out of one of those rooms and see how scary it gets? Uh, go look for more slide reels. I mean, the low lens is the one thing that it says there's more to explore here for now, so we can go back there. Very interesting. Three, two, one, blast off. Scared of the dark. Sounds like you need to play Pajama Sam. There's no need to hide when it's dark outside. Sounds like I do. We are gonna play that like in the break between Witness and whatever else. We're gonna go through our Pajama Sam games. I have not forgotten about them. We've just been like so into a couple of big series right now. So whenever the Witness is done, we're gonna do that. Oh, thank you. Thank you, mods. Please be careful of spoilers. Please don't say any game information or, um, Oops, nope, nope, nope. Or tips, or uh, mechanics even, stuff like that. I will try to figure it out on my own. Thank you. Yeah, exactly, Puppin' Suds. I'm like, uh... <laughs> Whenever I'm done streaming The Witness and I decide to continue my pursuit of knowledge of puzzles off stream, ship. We'll get the hang of it eventually. Wait, what? <laughs> Sorry. Don't know what happened there. Creative solution. <laughs> yeah, Ta, it's happening already, see? We're just <laughs> clipping into walls with our with our landings. It's fine. Too interrupt is too furious. <laughs> Thank you, mods. Again, I will keep saying this. Maybe I'll make a command for this too. Although I like I like addressing it. It's not anything personal, especially for this game. If your message gets deleted, we still want you here. We still want you hanging out. Um just stick to topics that aren't the game. And and assume I want to know nothing. <laughs> I appreciate it. Oh, I know what we were gonna try to do. 
We were still able to get to that section, though. Um... This is where we did that one parkour maneuver. Right here. The noises. Because I don't think if I come through here... Oops, 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 I need to keep this lit. landing thanks another happy landing hey we survived um now we have a raft a vessel oh this is what this looks like when it's not burnt gosh it's hard it like everything changes so much or not burnt flooded everything changes so much when it floods and it unfloods i have trouble remembering what each area looks like you know But that's the other entrance into the tower. If we want to go back there, we can. Or we could try to get a ship to go in that other... Over here. I don't know how that's going to happen, right? Because it's going to pull... We saw it pulls it through the center. get up higher and see more we love you we just don't want to risk any of Jen's future discoveries because we love those two exactly it is not you it is the nature of the game we've been up up there before on that ledge I think and there's it's just that we need a boat over on this side over here I don't know let's try it We've got a boat. Let's just let's just try it. Let's go for it. What's the worst that can happen? We have to try again. That's like all the fun of it, right? Okay, so we went very strongly into this wall, but hopefully that means we get into this far canyon. I don't think we've seen this canyon yet. Oh, the power outage. The flickering. What is it? Well, I think this one looks exactly the same as the other one. Well, it's fine. about this side over here. Aha! This is new. We wanted to get over here. Ship log updated. Nice. Nice! Beam us up. Mild excite. I like that emote happening here oh oh that's cool oh that's really cool well if we can go up we can go back down right there are still many human emotions Ooh. I don't fully <laughs> comprehend anger Hatred, revenge. But I am not mystified Thank by the you, desire Sammy. to be loved. Or the need for friendship. These are things I do understand. Thank you for the 500 bits. Thank you for cheering for humanity. I appreciate it. Enjoy that data alert. It's brand new. Oh, there's a bunch of stuff to do over here. But this is all going to get destroyed when the dam breaks. Oh, <gasps> Scary room, scary room. No one saw I didn't do- What are you talking about? No one saw what? 
Okay, I need these lanterns. That definitely makes a noise. It does make a noise. I thought it was the tower falling. Do we just jump on in? Oh, we can't use our jetpack because of the light. What is the noise that happens when you do that? Okay, now I'm just jumping around in nonsense. There's a staircase. <gasps> Oh, creepy. Oh, this is really creepy. And oh my god, the noises are so good. Oh, I don't like it. Okay. What am I seeing? The flames. They showed us the flame thing in that one projector. Looks like a party. Not any party I want to go to. Buddy. Yes. Yes. Oh, the yes. follow alert even yes. got me. Thank you for the follow. Thanks for supporting a fellow human. Welcome in. I am so... Nobody do boops. <laughs> I, somebody's gonna do it now, but the jump scares are like... Oh, this is so creepy. This is the fire I don't want to roast a mallow by. Oh, this is so scary. And those are the devices that we saw. There it is. Not the boops, but the yay. Thank you for the sound alert. I don't want to doze off in this room. Did this uplo updo update our ship's log? What happens if I turn my flashlight off? Oh, weird. It's like if the flame is lit, it goes through the little window and then it lights the flame inside of the thing. Is what it seems like, but I don't know. And then it, it lights, it powers, it does something here. Everyone gets some more. Oh. oh. I don't really know what to do with that yet other than go, oh, scary. Do all of these have things or is it just the um the planet one do i have to move them completely outside of the room no oh that's the dam oh my god okay we ran out of time all these other cool buildings I wanted to explore are gonna go bye bye soon. Can we make it across the bridge? Go! There's a projector in here. Ooh, and there's one of these things in here. Oh, you can pick it up. Can we take this to one of the flames? Is this room gonna get flooded or not? I heard the bridge like cracking. 
I don't think we want to take this to one of the flames, but I don't know. I'm curious. Of course I'm curious. That's like the whole point. <gasps> There's more things, but we don't have a lantern. And now I think the bridge is gone. Yeah, but can we make, did, how far, did, what kind of a jump did I do? <laughs> we can make that, right? Oh yeah, easy. Should we just go for it and go down here? I'm really curious to see what happens. Sykes, hi, welcome. Is this gonna be- oh man. Okay, I don't know if this is gonna be real scary or what. I don't know. Maybe it'll- I don't know. Bees, hi, welcome in. How's it going? Oh goodness. Yes! Yes! How do we do this? Yes. Is there a way to properly like use this thing? I'm not sure. Ooh. Thank you for the follow. Thanks for supporting a fellow human. Welcome in. Can I like... Oh, I didn't really want to do that, but we can roast a marshmallow, I guess. That's not what, that's not what I was trying to do. I wanted to drop the artifact. Okay, let's get out of here, I guess. Too scary for Jen. We wanted to we want to grab one of the lanterns and bring it back over so we can see those other slide reels cuz those are crucial so far. Ready for some more parkour. Or whatever this is. We Got a few to choose from. Let's pick you first. Okay. Another one that shows us how they walked. The vault. There's another one of the weird, like, flame devices that they walk into. And there's a fire. Oh, this is the third one. Okay. And that's it. That's all it shows. But this is with glowing eyes, so presumably after we saw the shocked face. And this is when they were... They were mad about whatever happened with the eye of the universe and they went we're gonna stop this uh which one you oh there's only two i thought there were three down here shocked face yeah All those lore emotes, yes. Show them off, enjoy them. This is that artifact, the device. Maybe now it's going to show us how to use it properly because I couldn't figure it out yet. Ooh, more music. Looking at our solar system. Watching everything spin. Walking away. There's a classroom. Slide reels. We're having a conference. The slide reel is showing the ringed planet that we've seen in the paintings. 
and some of the buildings on stilts. And the trees used to look very different and there used to be grass. They're in a Discord call sharing their screen. Uh-huh. They're like leaning closer to look. They're gesturing. One of them's putting their head in their hands. One of them has a broken antler. They're like consoling, comforting one another. Oh, creepy. More burnt slides. Lots of burnt slides. And I, I can't really make anything out of this other than it looks like veins and bubbles, kind of. Oh, this is the room we just saw. With their artifacts. Closing their eyes. Are we supposed to doze off in there? And take a little nap? Not make a marshmallow, but take a nap? I don't know why this photo is so upsetting to them. What are they seeing here? With the ringed planet. Where is this ringed planet? And there's not another one down here, right? I just want to triple check. I think we've got time to jump back across again and I guess try to take a nap. Hard work in this game. Lots of napping. There's so many more. We are going to have to come back here. Look, there's the symbol of the artifact on that door down there. Maybe they're looking at that projector and it's it's just supposed to help us know and confirm again that that's the door we're supposed to take the lamps away from. Okay. Ooh, green stuff. No. Oh, yeah. Oh! <gasps> Are we a ghost? What did we do? Oh, I want reduced fright now. <laughs> I'm so afraid for whenever it's gonna like kick us in the butt the first time. I don't know, jump scare warning, but I don't know when it's coming. Just everyone know that this is actually a s s terrifying game. Can we still... We don't have... Focus and conceal. Oh, cool. I was like, do we still have a flashlight? We do not. So weird. Okay, what does it look like out here? Pitch dark. <gasps> oh, I hate it. Oh, no. But there's the planet. Oh, 
Uh, yeah, I don't like that. We're just gonna go back inside. Oh, there's the music. It sounds so different. What happens if we focus this in here? Ooh. And we can doze again. Can we put this thing down? We can. What happens if we drop it? We can just hang out and run around in absolute darkness? Fun. That is so scary! But there's other lights besides ours. I don't even know if it's our light that is like alarming something, but I kind of assume. What does the supernova look like out here? Also, can we get to our map from here? Does it say where we are? No, we literally have no other options except for do stuff with this lamp. Anything happens out here after the song but I do not want to know what happens if I walk around out here with my light on oh oh that scared me I thought okay it's because it's the end what have they done what have they included oh that is so scary That sure was a loop. We're still on a timer the whole dang time. Yup. Mm-hmm. Oh, I did not like that. Okay. I liked everything we found out I until the scream. Everything was awesome about that loop. And then... There was a scream. Actually, no, I take that back. The, um, skeletons of the owl people was not awesome. It was sad and kind of scary. Comfort marshmallow. Yeah, <laughs> mellow time. We are at six hours. Um, I'm going to go read my ship's log and then we can decide if we want to keep going for tonight. Three out of ten owl skeletons, exactly. Hidden Gorge, Endless Canyon, Burn Slide Reel. Okay. A narrow gorge along the rightmost branch of the river. There are dwellings built into both cliff faces high above. There's more to explore here. Yeah, we only went into, like, two buildings. A slide reel that shows the stranger's inhabitants congregating around a strange green fire. Several sides have been burned and cannot be viewed. A massive canyon that stretches into the distance. A candlelit lodge is built into the far cliff face. There's more to explore here. Uh, and sealed vault. A slide reel from Cinder Isles showed a glowing symbol and chains appear around a strange vault. A slide reel from a hidden gorge showed the same thing. Six hours, I know. I knew we were going to stream long, but, like, that's really long. When are we next going to congregate around a strange green fire? <laughs> but what if we... But what if we congregated around a strange green fire together? I want to tab out really quick. Um, let's take a moment.
what else were we gonna do that loop and then I decided to go for that canyon we could go back to that I think I want to do one more loop and I want to go to the hidden canyon and walk around some more of the buildings in the daytime <laughs> and see what else we find maybe before the bridges all break I know one more loops I know <laughs> Can you blame me? <laughs> no, none of us can. We've all been there. Okay. Three, two, one, blast off. I want some comforting. I should have stuck around for the Timber Heart music, at least for a little bit. I need some comforting space solar system music. A nice loop to forget about owl skeletons. I know, I need something not horrifying screams. We will tackle that next stream. We will do whatever we need to do with that. But I want to do a loop before we end that's like, oh yes, another part of the canyon. Wow, pleasant. Well, remember how nice the raft music is? Gosh. <laughs> Let's go back to those times. I have a stuffed great owl, great horned owl I hug, who helped me deal with those, yeah. Um, we will be back Wednesday with more of this. I'm not gonna end up streaming tomorrow, but that is okay. I'm gonna be thinking about it all day, though. <laughs> I don't, I wanna leave off with not too many, like, puzzles to ponder over because if we can solve things on stream you know I want to um, but if we're leaving off like okay this is the next area I want to explore I think that's a good a good plan I'm not gonna stream tomorrow wink oh, tomorrow we streamed every day Wednesday Thursday Friday Saturday well Saturday I didn't stream but I was on another person's stream Sunday, Monday. I think I'm gonna take my day off tomorrow. <laughs> That's okay with you all. Because we had a surprise Thursday stream last week. I don't normally do that. Yeah. We've been busy. It's, it's go time. It's busy season. like a noise that kind of sounds like our um oh, no. kind of sounds like our scout just a little bit okay now how did we do this before be more rested yeah true Whew. we went to a spot where it lifted our raft up out of the water. Not this one. Um, one further down. Okay, we're, we're... I don't think it was over there. Yeah, yeah, I remember this. Okay, this is fine. Don't get beached! This is all fine. This is all normal. But we're gonna need to go to the right through here. Over this way to that one right there. Which is pretty straightforward. Oh, actually, we can go all the way this way because we dropped down from there afterwards and went this way. Every time I picked up or put down a lantern in the DLC, its sound made me think I was pressing a button in Half Life. Yeah. It's funny how some sounds just really stick with you. Okay, we're bonking into the side of this wall, but it's gonna pay off. We gotta get back to Hidden Canyon. I don't wanna go too far to the left, but now we're just continuously rolling through here. There we go. Love the rafting music so much. 
much prefer this to uh, some of the slide reel songs. But they, they do, it's so good how creepy it is. Obviously, you know, it's not the like intense, awesome track of the game, but it's so appropriate. Oh, oh. Let's explore. Look, looking up at the sky and seeing more canyon is so bizarre. <sighs> is this just a sign? Oh, this was the elevator we took up. Can we also take the elevator down? I don't think so. There's like stuff down there though. Yes, Maybe. Yes, yes, yes. Electric, thank you for the follow. Thanks for supporting a fellow human. I'm glad you've been here for this. Um, there's some furniture. Oh, this is a broken elevator mechanism. So maybe we can't do that much. Gets me every time. Uh, until we go up the elevator. That's fine. I wonder if something from our solar system like bonks into the side of that and makes the the power go out. Makes the lights flicker. down anymore, right? No. Just making sure. Lots of spinning around. <laughs> I wonder if we can go up again? It doesn't seem like it. It's just a little ledge right there. Okay. Alright. And we are gonna be able to explore this after the flood. It's just gonna be a lot of jumping back and forth. Those are the two rooms we already did. Should we go over there? I just can't make up my mind. Oh, this all- okay, there's another bridge on this side, so it all sort of loops around in multiple different ways. And we know where we can get a bunch of lanterns. Is there going to be another slide reel down here? Oh, what are you? Another raft? Yeah. I think. Door to the outside. Picture of owl people in a tree. Furniture. Ooh. Oh. Observation deck. Not door to the outside. Door to a cool area. This doesn't get added to my ship log? Interesting. Maybe we- maybe this isn't a- I feel like this is definitely a raft. Uh, I'm afraid to- to undo- we- we can come back to there, but I don't want to jump down and then not- and be- not be in this area anymore. Oh, there's too many paths. And get lost in here. This reminds me, what is that place uh, in the base game with the classroom? Is that in Riddle Hollow? Yeah. I can't remember what it's called, but ooh. This is a symbol of a flame and a slide reel. Oh, bur is this where they burn all the slide reels? Is this the um, ghost map?
Do they throw them in here to burn them? Is this actually where ghost matter came from? I can jump up there, maybe? Do I want to? I don't know. I want to, like, make a decision about any of these, and I can't. I think maybe Hanging City, yeah. I can't remember the name of it. Okay. Um, let's go over here. No, that's where we came from, right? Let's go up here. Mm-hmm, let's go up here. What are you? I saw you from across the canyon, and I knew I wanted to investigate. You're another elevator. Elevators are cool. I think it just makes a giant circle, because I think that's the one we use to get up to these two main buildings. That's where the slides are. This is where all the lanterns are. I'm like doubling back a ton already because I'm just so... There's too much to look at. Did we go down here? Yes. There's another elevator. Should we try it? Wait, now I'm con- Oh, one of them- Okay, there's two elevators, and one of them, the mechanism at the bottom is just broken, so you can't call it down to you. And I'm 95% sure that other area is a raft, because look how the floor is the same, the little green lights are exactly the same, and this area is all about to get to just- all about to be destroyed. What about that one over here? Have we been to that yet? I don't think so. Why didn't I go there after I did this? Oh, because I think the path is somewhat blocked. Oh, shit, that scared me because of the flood. <laughs> what are we going to lose? Are we going to lose this building? It's locked. But we can get there from here. No, that's locked too. This one's not. Oh, that startled me. Well, now we can open it, but why would we want to come in here? That jump, yeah. We're about to be toast. Oh, maybe not? That wasn't as bad as I thought. Oh, there it is! There's a slide- a slide reel on that table. Oh. Yeah, I can launch the scout, but... It's not gonna fit. I wanna get down there. How do we get down there? There we go. I just wasn't doing this door properly. But that doesn't get us access to the... basement. now we're at this door again. How do we get to you? Is there another spot with, with where I have to take like a raft up into this room or something? Slide reel, I must have you. Hmm. I don't 
don't know. We'll figure it out. What about over here? Is there a window on the side? No. It doesn't look like there's a hole in the wall over there. Weird. Oop. Can we... Hmm, I don't know. Maybe we need to go down here again. But that was where it showed us another... Weird... I don't know. I want to keep exploring. I think we might have seen... most everything? Did we go down here? Should we just make a jump for it and check it out? Another elevator. We might get stuck here now. Hmm. We can still get over there to that other elevator, it looks like, if we're careful. But at this point, I'm not really sure. Hmm. Did it tell us there was more to explore here, or did it tell us only that there was more to explore with the Endless Canyon? I'll have to double check. stuck on an elevator can be stressful it has its ups and downs oh number <laughs> all right no it's not this one it's oh it is this one right oh. Oh, that noise is so horrifying. I don't know that we're gonna have time, but we can try to do it again and, and, and go out with a awful, awful jump scare. Because I don't know what else to do here for now. Other than try to get that slide reel. It's so scary though. Why am I doing this again? We were gonna try to forget this. And now here we are doing it again. There's our flame. Creepy, creepy. I also kinda wanna know, I know it was supposed to be the happy loop, but I couldn't. But then I was too curious. I wanna. I want to see the thing and I want to like make a run for it while concealing this but I can't even see like no it's not that it's concealed maybe it's just something I don't know the hyper eyes is such a mood 
So it, it, we confirm that it actually has nothing to do with whether this is lit or not. Can we see something new over there up above? I don't want to go look. There's a music. I'm never going to know if I don't... go out there, but it's too scary. Spooky speedrun zero bonks. I know if I just go for it, we'll learn more stuff, but I don't know. So I also want to, um, I don't know, make a note, remind that when I first heard about this, the zero, the reduced fright thing, God, I don't want to go out here. I don't know. I, um, I thought we were going to immediately turn it on. So I think we will be using it, but I wanted to see what it, candles, what it was that was super scary before we made a decision on it. Oh. I'm afraid to move. Like, I don't think I can do this. <laughs> Candles. Is that like a good type of light where we can like switch back and forth? We don't know how to get out of this state. Extinguish? No, I think that's a bad idea. Oh my god. Okay, please come to the end of the loop. I'm ready for the end of the loop. Thank you. <laughs> oh my gosh. Take me, loop. I'm ready to start fresh. So I wonder if just whenever you do that cycle, if you get a scream when you walk out the door because it's scary and the game put a scream there, I do not know. So we're gonna have to be brave or do something or or do redu re reduced fright. Um. Oh. Also, Darren, hello. You got a bee leaf. Mm -hmm. That is, let's end on a cozy mallow. Everybody, exclamation point mallows. Um, if you would like in the chat to roast a mallow with me. And we will end it there. We'll wrap up. Thank you so much for joining me for my first day of this game. Um, it's been a journey. It's so interesting. Maybe the real scream was the friends we made along the way. Exactly. It's... I was, like, nervous at the beginning of stream, so unsure of what to do, so, like, couldn't focus, couldn't do anything right, and, and I feel like now we're in the groove of things. So, we will be back, um, Wednesday with more of this. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be thinking about this game for sure. Let's, let's switch back over to chatting, let's find somebody to raid, and let's wrap up our night.